Good shit, hello! Um, Tretch time. We're gonna be doing Tretch today, finally. So, I've just been putting in this off because Tretch is a stinky little man. But apparently now he's good. He used to be trash. He's always been trash. I think everybody cohesively as a community knows that Tretch is the stinkiest boy around, the worst rat lord in the whole game, and he might actually be better than a lot of them now. He's gained the tri the attribute Devastating Flanker for all units in the entire army, which by the way, I love. I love it when a, a general provides something for an entire army because then suddenly it opens the doors to so many builds. To so many, so many units that were trashed before are now suddenly actually kind of good. You know what I mean? So, like, uh, fuck, what's his name? Uh... What are they called? The Rat Hounds. People keep telling me that this guy has... An incredible doom stack based around the rat dogs whatever the fuck they're called rat dogs right rat hounds i i made a fucking doom stack on them and i can't remember the name of them but anyway th i mean they're not as good as throughout the uncleans because he can make them explode and destroy entire armies but you know treachel in the meantime it, we're not gonna build that we're gonna build a storm vermin doom stack i think wolf rats wolf rats see i don't know why do i was <laughs> dogs on the brain i don't know man Good boys? Yeah. Yeah, they are good boys. But anyway, so I think for now, I'm thinking clan rats, storm vermin, not clan rats, fucking, what are they called? Uh, chieftains. Chieftains, storm vermin, doomstack. Because what I didn't realize is Tretch, I, I had to fuck around with him when I was trying to get thumbnails and stuff like that, and I also got a, a thing of him for uh, the Doom Wheels video that I'm working on. I'm working on a 20 Doom Wheels Doomstack, finally, because I just felt like playing Ikit. Doom Wheels are a unit that I really don't have that much experience using, so I thought I'd dip my toe into those scaveny little waters and uh, fuck around with something that isn't just weapon teams like I usually do. Anyway. Wait, did I? Oop. I did not. There we go. Alright. So, I was thinking I will put the endgame difficulty down to 50, but we'll do an, a full ultimate crisis mode with diplomacy enabled and every single scenario ticked, obviously. Well, I mean, you don't need to because ultimate crisis mode sets them off all at the same time. So I think the ultimate test for Tretch is this, is Tretch versus fucking ev like everyone, right? Not a total war, this is total war campaign, but a 
<laughs> an ultimate crisis mode. So that, that being said, Vermintide is still in here, so maybe we'll get given a bunch of free shit. I don't think that's the case, but every other Skaven faction will be given a bunch of shit. So at least we're not totally fucked, right? 19 Packmasters summoning 38 Wolf Rats in battle is pretty crazy. Yes, I, I know, I did 19 Packmasters, which was very fun. Still one of the most underrated Doom Stacks, I think. Just the, the, that being said, Wolf Rats kind of suck dick, especially unbuffed. This modded, uh, I do have a couple of mods. Um, how do you check what you got installed? I can't check without going out. Basically, it's just quality of life shit. I, I'm, t I'm using the ultimate, um, lighting thing. And a couple of other things that just, like, tweak the game in different ways. I think I have one on that turns on more... Settlement battles, though, so me I might have to back out and turn that off. I, sh I don't like that they were removed from the game entirely, because I realized after doing like three full campaigns that I hadn't done a settlement battle, a minor settlement battle in, like, I did about two over three full campaigns. It was like, fucking cool. I, mi I, I missed them. I never hated them as much as a lot of people. Anyway, let's dive in. Let's see what tools this man has at his disposal. What I was going to say, though, is Storm Vermin can actually get very fast. If you would get every buff available to Tretch and to the Storm Vermin, you can actually get, um, I think, like, 50 speed for Storm Vermin, which is nuts. It, it puts them up on the same level as, like, buffed, uh, what are the armor-piercing fellas? Weeping... And I'm bad at remembering names. It's the guys that were added in with Eshin, the, the, the Death Masters or whatever the fuck. The Pathfinding during the Minor Salamis drove me crazy. Yeah, very true, very true. The, they've improved it. I will say it is. it has improved. It's just, it's still not, you know, it's not quite where we want it to be. There's a lot of other bugs, to be honest. All right, here we go. Oh, it's snowing. Oh, also, I have the ultimate lighting overhaul Jesus mod on, just so we can see how that affects the game. Groom? But just grooming people. Silent killer. Yes, yes. All right. So we'll just take all the agents we can get. I think. Upgrade the clan barracks right out the gate. We got the. What does this do? Recruitment cost minus twenty percent for storm Roman. Great. Recruit rent plus two for storm Roman. Amazing. Immunity to psychology for storm Roman in all armies. Is goddamn. Wow, that's actually great for Skaven. God damn, that's amazing. That's that's so good. <laughs> that's really good for for Skaven. I mean, to psychological attacks, fear and terror. That's amazing. I mean, there's not a lot of stuff that, you know. There's not a lot of stuff that the the AI you're gonna recruit that causes terror or even fear. But fuck it. Call me Lord Craven Tate. Here's the boy, Yuri B. Devastating flank for the entire army. So we gotta make sure we do, try and do as many ambushes as possible. We, if we get attacked by an overwhelming army and they push us, I need to remember to retreat. And... I got any other caveats? Gain the following for three turns after declaring war. So make sure I'm in a good position to attack before declaring war. Ambush success chance plus 25% for all armies for three turns. Ow, fuck! Um, ignore that. I didn't drop anything. Scurry away has an improved effects and grants minor ward save when active. Ooh. 10% ward save when leadership is wavering or lower, and 25% speed. Additional one armor and base weapon damage for all storm vermins per rank. Dude. Oh, we're gonna be stacked. We're gonna be really chunky at the end of this. I think everything applies to clan rats too, though, so the more ranks we get on clan rats early game, the better. What? Medium? Out the gate? Okay, we're gonna crush this. I'm not taking medium casualties. The, <laughs> the the auto resolve, by the way, for this game is fucking borked. I've been doing the uh, that Doom Wheel Doom stack, right? And I have I have twenty. Hang on, let me see if I have a screenshot of that because it is ridiculous. It is just so stupid and bad. How unfair the auto resolve is. <laughs> Look at this. Wanna tell me what the fuck this is? How is this even close? I don't know if you guys can see that. But essentially... Oh, wrong one. 
It's uh <laughs> I cannot get this to fit. Fuck off. Yeah, look. Pyrrhic victory with high casualties. For this doom stack against this Bretonian army. This is like turn 15. Turn 10, turn 15. Like, are you fucking kidding me? What? Yeah, they have a unit of Grail Guardians. Like, okay, but what? I, I couldn't even believe this. I did this fight, by the way. No casualties. No casualties. Not even any any like damage on the units. Just nuts. They really have no faith in them. Boy, it's weird hearing that. Let's look at this guy. So also, I have a I have an EMB thing installed. Finally, a reshade. So if the game looks crisper than usual with better lighting, it's because we have a slight amount of sharpening on. I can also do some fun shit like I could uh, add film grain. I could add, where is it? Uh, I can make it. Oh, oh! <sighs> what the fuck? That is awful. Holy shit. Oh, that looks really strange. Ow, that hurts my eyes, fuck. Oh, we can make it black and white for a really old timey battle. We could do Technicolors to add like a little bit of a crazy color to the game. Some tints. There's tone mapping. I can't remember which one. Oh, I can add a vignette. I fucking hate vignettes. I take them off every game. Ah! Dalton eyes, whatever that is. Curves. Cartoon. Oh, it adds like... Oh, wow. Wait, can I turn... Can I jack that up to really make it look like a real cartoon? Where's my, my, my warp that just looks really fucking strange. <laughs> they don't look like cartoons. It gives it that Borderlands effect. Anyway, I'm not gonna fuck with that. We do, but I recommend those, by the way, because just uh, shopping has such a dram dramatic effect on this game. Look, so like just this, and then if, if I just toggle shopping off, I'll get fucked. I don't know if it'll come out on the stream, but it just adds a little bit, a little, little bit of an edge and a crisp quality to everything. It looks great. Okay, let's just push. I don't even need to be careful in this fight. I could win this entire fight with a doom wheel, actually. Hold on. I could win this whole fight with a fucking doom wheel. This is just, this is a fucking meme. I don't know. Can I get a PS PS One graphics? I just, I don't think it could, it, it's just a filter over the game. It can't like reduce poly or anything like that. I don't think Doomwheels are as strong as I initially thought. They have more mass though than they've ever had. This is ridiculous. We're just gonna win like this. Oh, fuck it. Let's go. Let's fuck him up. Total War Warhammer 2033 just to colorize. <laughs> Hidden enemy. Skaven. Yes, yes. Red. Green skin genocide colorized circa whatever this is. Whatever, whatever time period this game takes place in. I, oh, also, I really like the colorized color, the uh, outfit colors for. Uh, Plan Richter Stone Room in this like, just like like a kind of dirty white. Speaking of dirty whites, are you guys like in the stream? <laughs> uh, how's Stretch doing? Uh, pretty fucking good. I mean, in terms of uh, unspottable leadership. Ooh, is that just for everyone? Oh, let's go. I've never. Has anybody ever made actual use of that? By the way. 35 seconds of stalk and unspottable. I tell you what, that actually would be pretty decent for uh, closing the gap. Yes, yes, yes. Now that I'm kind of thinking more about it, like if you want to, if you want to get all of your stone vermin nice and close and get through all their range, stalk and unspottable. Hmm. Oh, do I even need to play this out? Uh, I think Tretch has really good melee stats, though. It's sort of dawning on me that melee defense in a one-on-one -on -one duel is actually extremely good. Oh, this little goblin. 
What did you, Twitch just beat the fuck out of Sneeko? Get him. Get him. Look at his little fucking st goblins are hilarious, dude. <laughs> Get him! Stop hitting Sneeko! Fuck it. Ooh. <laughs> Good. Good old Skaven. Medium casualties, my fucking dickhole. Very hard difficulty? Uh, very hard campaign difficulty, normal battle difficulty. If, because we're going for a melee army, I'm just gonna play the, the what's normal. I hate, I hate how weak your troops get. Your melee troops, I've said it a million times. Campaign difficulty legendary are, are very hard though, always. Like, if you play anything less than like, I don't know, hard, very hard, around that rate. Like, honestly for me, like at least minimum very hard. For campaign difficulty because it just makes it actually fun and challenging. Adokoi, stealth sorcerer is pretty good for melee skaven. Ooh, that's a good point. The, uh, you mean the Ashen sorcerer? Uh, right? Is that what you're talking about, or do you mean um, plague priests? What does that mean? Skitter leap is good for closing the gap. The archer's black hole is pretty great for sieges. Oh, so. Warlock Engineer. They have, they have the, uh, what's their, what is their magic called, actually? I actually have no idea. Lore of, Skaven spells of stealth, Skaven spells of, oh. Skaven spells, so it's, it's Lore of Ruin. Man, it's been a long time since I've used the, uh, Lore of Stealth setup. Some of them are actually pretty good. I remember Black Whirlwind being pretty solid. The Skaven don't get access to a lot of like a big, big bad, big killing spells. Eduko, you ever use uh, unit mods for rats? There's a lot of good ones. I have used a couple. I just realized your name. <laughs> Okoy's Discord Kitten. That's, that's gross. That's real gross. Clan of Worms. You know what? I'm gonna get. Yes. 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 2K. God damn. I just bankrupted these guys. They were gonna drag me into a lot of wars. I don't want to be in. But also, I don't care because I want more Skaven allies. Grand Banner of Sk Clan Superiority. Good shit. All right. What's our odds? Uh. Yeah, we could win that pretty soundly. Might as well take it. Uh, Skitter Elite got moved to stealth. Oh. Interesting. Uh, I will look into getting a, uh, Lore of Stealth Caster then. It's been a, a while since I've used one of those guys. Melee attack for... Guys, they're the fastest. Well, I'm, I gotta play this. But this will be a minor settlement battle then, I think. Unless they only have a tier 1 settlement, in which case it'll be a field battle. There you go, enemy sallies out into the f uh, fight on the field. So you still get to do a lot of land battles, but the difference is like... You know... You actually get to do some settlement battles, you know? Hi, Okoy. Earlier I fought Skaven without auto-resolving. For the first time, I used my normal setup, and uh, yes. then a green rocket fell from the sky and wiped out four Hi. units. What the fuck? Dude, you got off fucking easy. Have you seen... Have you seen what Ikid Claw can do? Never fight Ikid Claw's faction on the field. If you can, always auto resolve because as soon as you play, you're gonna get nuked. It's always gonna happen. Ikid is an absolute chad. Never fight him in the field. I completely forgot about. Oh, damn. I'm dropping frames. What's going on? So this is the lighting mod, I'm pretty sure. It's like nighttime in the desert. This is really pretty, holy shit. It's like smoky nighttime. Very Skaven appropriate. Did they change Tretch? Uh, I was away for Warhammer 3 for a bit. Uh, yeah, so a lot of people didn't know that he, he got some like crazy buffs. So every single unit in his army has um, devastating flanker and then uh, all somber get immunity to psychology from his um, clan building. Those are the main ones, and then you got a bunch of other shit as well. Uh, you'll see as we get through the campaign, but 
Yeah, supposedly Tretch is good now. I'm not sure about Tretch specifically as a melee lord, but he doesn't have terrible stats. He's got armor, he's got reasonable speed, he's got great melee defense. Like, on paper, he's okay. I think, I also like his outfit. I think if Tretch had cooler weapons, I think I would be a little bit more inclined to like him. Something about a spear in one hand and then a back scratcher in the other that just don't do it for me. Anybody else? Or is that just me? Am I alone on my pedestal of, of uh... There. Ooh, eat shit. Oh wait, oh, I think I missed the dono. Brutus with a five dollar dono. Hi, <laughs> hi, Brutus. <laughs> Y'all are nutty with these these donos. I only ever dono to say like if I want to ask somebody a question or some shit, and people are just like, hi. <laughs> Bit of testing out Trenchini, taking him out for a run, bro. Sounds like a bit of a sticky widget. Long as he ain't an umpty, I suppose. Enjoy your right arm with a fork. Hold on. Are Boy you trying to... always starving. Are you trying to be British? <laughs> you having the left? New victim. Now. That was not... British people won't say any of that shit. We say stuff like... Con. Like Australian people. Moving. Ready, ready. Thank you for the dono, by the way. At Okoy, Tretch has three weapons. You missed his tail knife. Oh, yeah, that's a good point. He has that little hook thing on his tail. Although, you may be thinking of, um... Snitch. Snitch is the guy with, with three actual weapons. His tail is holding a weapon at all times. It's like one of my favorite things about him. He's the only triple knife wielder in the whole game. Assassin! Rinky Shriek! Cunning plan scheme! Assassin! Push, 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 let's go. Oh, okay, we're losing. Oh, it's Caven Slave Spears, I don't give a fuck. Alright. Oh, wait! Oh, shit, how could I forget? Hey. Hold on. The monkey is missing. Uh, what's an appropriate one for a Skaven stream? I guess... Just a base monkey? Just like a regular old... Oh. Just a regular little guy? Just a norm normal little guy, right? Oops. I don't have a Skaven one, unfortunately. I don't know why. Oh, come on, this is a win already. Surely. Greetings. Oh my god, these donuts are... Guys, <laughs> chill. <laughs> chill your beans. Alright, Sieges, we don't need to play that out. I don't cam. Yeah, sorry, I forgot to... I, should, I really need to forget to... Stop forgetting to turn on the webcam. Damn, 159 kills for the Doom Wheel. 115 for the uh, Death Fellas. I always thought some of them were pretty goddamn cool. It's kind of fun to think that they might actually be able to be built up to a point where they're genuinely viable. Maybe not a very hard campaign. Greetings. With very hard battle difficulty and all that, with the amount of, uh, you know, issues. Ooh, that's gonna bankrupt me for food a little bit. Salutations. Uh, okay, Brandon, I'm gonna, I'm gonna have to slam the hammer down, son. <laughs> you fucking quit it. Good morrow. Uh. Okay, we already got a military building. Financial. Just a whole lot mess of clan rats. Yes, 44 per turn. Get that. Wow. That is so not worth it. Holy shit. That is so not worth it. Oh my god. 56 for a unit of Skaven Slaves. Wait. You're okay, my I'm favorite sorry. Femboy tuba. 
What is happening? Stop! <laughs> what? Femboy VTuber. Oh, dude. I am <laughs> way too ugly to be a Femboy. I got too much man hair. Um. Maybe army buffs? I don't know, man. God, it's been too long since I played Skaven. I don't know what it is. Every time I go and try to play an old faction, I just remember the fact that I've already spent 2,000 hours of Warhammer 2 with them. I'm like, I'll just play a Warhammer 3 faction. Like, always. Because I have so much less time with them. A fat rat image, Mr. Boombastic. Mm, thank you for the dono, by the way, Foxy. <laughs> I'm glad I'm your favorite something. Oh, easy replenishment. Good. We have discovered anybody. We've got no rights that we can do. Yeah, we're on turn one. Let's just keep going. I want this fucking stack already, dude. Adokoi, their FP is higher than usual because you need more tech and you have <coughs> low food. Oh. Right, that'll be why then. Fair enough. Oh, the Docklands feel so empty without um, any DLCs. If only CA would release some kind of DLC that would flush out the Docklands. Hmm. That'll be a nice race pack. Eventually. Oh wait, ambush success chance. That would have been way more useful. Fuck. Damn it. Can't make it there in one turn. Do half the run. Recruit some more shit. Take Doc Hold. All right, we're gonna have to go deal with the with the Mr. Eyeballs pretty early, right? I don't think he's gonna get away with it. Also, I don't. Uh, I are we not allowed to mention Okui's obsession with Bingo Tiger here? Call me Lord Craven Bingo Tiger. Wait, is this a setup? Is this a setup for Bingo Tiger? These nuts? Something? I fall for them so often. I'm just. I don't know why I don't expect them more. I don't know what that is. I don't call it. We need a sneaky monkey for Tretch. Yes, if somebody could make a sneaky monkey, I would be appreciative. Wait, so is there is the upkeep of Skaven Slaves based on... Construction costs, growth, leadership uh, armies. No, no upkeep production here. Oh, finally. Clan Rats, Skaven Slaves, Cash Flash Flanish Rent 5%. Nice. Did that change? I don't remember that. All right, whatever. Let's just get in. At Okoy, I'll keep decreases are in the second part of the Lord's blue line. No, I know that. <laughs> what? I'll keep fails with research and all right, fair enough. Oh, right. We have the uh, Confederation mod. I forgot about this. Uh. Well, we'll just accept them, I guess, even though we're not going to get anything from that. I don't know why it gives you the option to confederate factions that don't have legendary lords that are confederatable. Con 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 confeder confederable. Confederatable? Useless. Speed, always good. Sharp teeth. Alright. Oh, I love the bodyguard chieftain thing. This is like one of my favorite things about this faction. Uh, about... He's getting this first me the this first building and getting two <coughs> me <coughs> melee heroes right out the gate. As soon as we get, where is it? Uh, five. There it is. Suspiciously loyal. Five percent ward save for the accompanying lord. So good. Two sets of them. Amazing. Ten percent ward save. Uh, got this. All right, I think I'm at a point where I can just auto now. We're good. Fuck it, let's get ourselves just beamed in the in the food department. Growth. Uh, shit, dude. Food. You see, this is the, the irritating thing about the food system is I, I always feel in, uh, inclined to just do exploitative planning. 
above everything else. Despite me needing. Am I allowed like, to tell people that Hoka is a dog person? A dog person? I'm not a dog person. I'm definitely a cat person, my guy. Easily a cat person. Hi. Hi. Hey, yo! Wolf with a thousand knock? Wait. A thousand is, a uh, Wait. Danish... Danish crowns or something? Right? I forget. I'm so bad with money. I'm pretty sure Wolf is from... Oh, that's a hundred bucks. Holy shit. God damn, Wolf. Thank you, man. Holy fuck. Holy, holy heck it, no, Norwegian? Norwegian Krona. Right, okay. Nikolai Anderson, <laughs> I can imagine his. <laughs> I don't know money, it's not my fault. Holy shit, Wolf, goddamn, thank you. Thanks for all the donos, guys, Jesus Christ. I've only been streaming for like, 15 minutes, maybe? 20, 30 minutes, whatever. Goddamn, dude. I'll tell you what, I'll, I'll give you a, uh, a chieftain name. There, Wolf. We'll call him Wolfrat. Because Wolfrats. Chieftain of the Deep Thank you, my guy. Uh improvement cost. Draft Master always good. Oh, but ancient cunning. Oh, I, dude, I love this game. Every single one of these is useful. Ambush to Vance Chance. Fucking post chance stealing uh post battle loot. Renown and Fear, Lightning Strike, Quarterman, like everything in the blue line for Skaven is just the best. They're such good boys. Melee defense, as per usual. Alright, so maybe we just go- Oh, he hasn't killed the dwarves yet, that's actually very good. Adokoi, you told us you prefer dogs, but we should not tell it Kuro. I swear to god I'm not gaslighting. You are definitely gaslighting, I have always been a cat person, fuck you. Adokoi, can you help me- Get this couch in the back of my truck. Oh god, no. No, that's... Uh, no. I don't know what nefarious shit you have planned in the back of a truck, but uh, I'm, I'm not helping. No, sir. Now I must do it as well. Alright, just a whole mess of clan rats. Jesus Christ. Wait a minute. How the fuck is our recruitment so high? What? Local recruit capacity plus one, local recruit capacity plus two. God damn, dude. Thank you for the donuts again, guys. Seriously, holy crap. Wolf, as well. Uh, Adokoi, outside of Ogres, who would you say is your favorite campaign? Uh, Skaven. It's, uh, you know what, no, it's a tie between Greenskin and Skaven. Although, okay, that's the thing though. Ogres is not my favorite campaign right now. I love the Ogre Kingdoms. I love their lore. I love their characters. I love the, uh, their I place in the world. I believe you're definitely a dog oh. person given your obsessive love for Bungo Tiger. All right, did st I don't know who that is. I don't. I know it's gonna be some weird shit like that. That big fat pedophile guy who got banned from YouTube. I accidentally used one of his clips in like one of my videos because I didn't. I didn't know that he was like some creep. Um, <laughs> I'm not getting caught out. I'm a cat person. I don't like whoever that is. Fucking quit it. <laughs> Thank you for the donos though. You fucking gaslighters. <laughs> Uh, you were getting back from a bad day at work. It's your surprise to see Okoi stream. Feels good, man. Hey, glad you like it, my dude. Happy I can be that guy. That's like the coolest thing about streaming is like I watched content creators for years and years and years and years and years and years, and years, and years right? Um, like every, you know, like Turin and like Milk and Cookies and like kind of Legend of Total War, all these guys. Like I, they, they were my come home to like a bad day at work and to be able to be that for somebody else means the world to me, man. That's uh, that's huge. Um, uh, uh, I'm gonna let them deal with the dwarves and then we're gonna go. Fuck, what do I do? Wait, they don't like us. Oh, they don't like us because of military actions against their homies, but I also don't want to fight the uh, the eye biter faction because they're ogres and I love ogres. Oh, yeah, like I was saying, I love the ogre kingdoms, but I don't like how they play right now. I don't like, I don't like that the camps aren't movable. Uh, even though CA explicitly have said that that's what they want to do with the Vector, that's not the plan that they have for them. They 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 like the way camps work, I guess. But I suggested that camps should be moved, uh, and they they disagreed, which is fair. They must have something planned for it. That's the only reason I think that they would turn down like that suggestion because a lot of people agreed with it. Um, I don't know. Are you from Boston? No, I'm from the UK. I'm from 
initially i'm from in between a town called leeds and a town called bradford in the northeast of england and i've never lived outside of the uk but i've spent a lot of time online developing a weird pan regional accent because i tried to drop my i think the a lot of people fade out of their accents as they get older M, but the more it's true you I've cannot deny over, your required oh, love oh. You wish for theater Stop beings. it! All right, Brandon, I appreciate the donors and the support, but you got to drop this weird shit to my guy. Um, oh fuck it, we're just gonna go for Silver Spirit, and then I'll come back down, and then we'll we'll take out uh we'll take out Bug Eyes, High Elf Bug Eye Man. All right, we got Wolfred, Ickball. I don't like that name. We'll call him. Uh, what's a good name for a chieftain? Uh Beef Supreme. One year ago I had no idea what Warhammer was. Legend of Total Wars videos introduced it to me, however, it was seeing your Doomstack videos that made me pick up Total War because you made it look oh, so man. fun. Thank you for the laughs. Hey, you're welcome, my guy. Uh, that's what I've always said about this game, is like there's a lot of fun to be had in it, and I think a lot of people play it. A lot of people approach Total War as a series in this kind of like uh, serious sort of like meta con like context and a lot of people enjoy that and no, there's no nothing wrong with that at all but uh, I always think people sort of slack on the just the goofy fun aspect of the game like building dumb armies building armies that are thematic building armies that aren't necessarily good but are fun you know I think a lot of people play this game like, oh, I should only recruit these because they're good. I shouldn't recruit these because they're total trash. Uh, there are exceptions, actually. Some units are just total dookie shits and you should never bother with them. Like, uh... Huh. I would know for the factions that I... That, that, okay, Skaven units that are bad. There's not a lot. See, that's, what, that's a good point. Like, Skaven are amazing. They have so many good, uh, like, usable units. There's not a lot of units that are just bad. Craven Thank you for the donut, though, my dude. I appreciate that. Uh, I live 45 minutes outside of Boston. That is not what they sound like. I can't help but notice that you don't live in Boston. <laughs> You've distanced yourself. Interesting. Interesting. I'm going to go this way because I can recruit. Wait. Yeah, I can. Hmm. Triads are pretty bad. Yeah, dude, they need a rebalance. That's you. Oh, fuck, I was in March stance. I'll eat my huge rat cock. Uh, ooh, the dog lens orcs are getting pretty horny on me. A version 9.2. I tell you what, I'm not gonna take that because I wanna kill you. Never mind. <laughs> I just realized. I should just take what they have and then maybe take the eye biter stuff. Although the eye biters will like me a lot more. Because they're at war with them. Ha ha, so that oh, please love for dogs goes BBRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRR
more tradables that'll make more factions like us more uh no no alarm tunnels we're good god damn dudes don't notice today i've been fucking insane it hasn't even been an hour yet like what the fuck Man, I just paid taxes too. I'm, I'm like fucking skinned. I've been, the government came into my house, pulled down my pants, lubed up their fist and took every dime, dude, seriously. Fuck me. The UK tax system, man. Ugh. Chieftain of the deep warrens. Not cool, not great. I've, ne I've never been, ooh, I'll tell you what. Stand before me Hell yeah, sister. I assent. Uh, Lamian Sisterhood. Hell yeah. I'll take some stinky. Mighty am I. Ooh. Yeah, yeah, just get okay. to the point. Only negative 10 aversion. I always feel like the Greenskins make great allies. I'm actually gonna. Yeah, we got a lot of money, so I'm gonna go Got for non aggression it. pact. Fuck it. I don't want to get attacked from up or the left, and this will help us curry favor. Alright, time to fuck up the orcs, maybe. How are we doing on growth? Uh, two more turns that I can get the tier three that allow us to recruit storm vermin. Awesome. I wish we got an upkeep reduction for storm vermin, man. Seriously. At Okoy, does Darkhold not have a landmark for Skaven? Darkhold. Uh, I don't know where Darkhold is. Isn't it? Wait, isn't that up in the the, the right, the upper right? We'll have a look at that. Because if I can take it, a uh, unique building would actually be great. Much like I think a lot of the community. Wait, what the fuck? What? Provincial instability, collected income, Skaven corruption, difficulty level minus food. Oh, okay, it'll be the, it'll be the uh, massive lack of food that's fucking us here. The fact that we're starving. Oh wait, how are we starving? Wait, minus four for settlement upkeep. The so five, six. We should be up. We're up three a turn. How are we ne that negative? What? Oh, I took the settlement. It's here too, right? Let me Come scavenge for on. food buildings. All right, we gotta get some. We gotta do some fights then. Um, uh, can I make my way back? I oh, I don't like the Docklands, dude. The Docklands are cringe. Dockhold. Wait, where's Dockhold? It's up here, right? Let me just check. I know I shouldn't, but... Uh, uh Do I already own Dockhold? No. Where the fuck is Dockhold? Oh. <laughs> you didn't see anything. You didn't see anything. Nope, there's no unique building in Darkhold. I, like most players, want there to be way, 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 way more unique buildings in this game, though. I feel like they're not a super difficult thing to program, I think. The only downside is having to have come up with unique artwork and then programming and, and thinking of a bunch of unique shit that can be there. But I think it really, it really, like, varies your campaign a lot. You know what I mean? I think it's a, a really goddamn fun way to mix up campaigns because then if you take a landmark actually feeling like you get some serious stuff out of taking a landmark is huge in this game uh let's just get some more turns in i guess fuck we're about to rebel here so that's a free fight i love unique buildings i can't play without these mods some uh, but some are just op yeah that's the thing ca are, are um you know for, for all the issues people have they're very good at adding in and balancing content uh, over a long period of time, so they'll get it to that point where it feels balanced. Uh, and they're and also they can program in new stuff, whereas modders can only do a certain amount of stuff. CA can add in brand spanking new shit to the game, like new programming, new stuff. They have full control over it. All right, tier three. Indeed. Joshi, Joshi, how In chilling. Washi, how shangoa. Uh, free fight. Maybe replace some with shielded. Wait, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. What are they? Oh wait, no. I need I need building resources. I'm not gonna waste it re recruiting with shields. How do I attack caravan? No. Why? Wait, do people attack caravans? Is that a thing? It's free scaven need to do that. Don't you get free money when they when they end in your territory? He lost a free 20 20 k. What? Are you f what? 20k? I would have got 20k from that? Caravans get you like 20k. That's news to me. What the fuck? And 20 food? 
What? Since when? I've never attacked him. They're just like, I don't want that smoke. Caravans give you like 10 up to 35k. The caravans low ball at 20k, high ball at 100k in the late game? Who the fuck? I did not know that since 2.0. Oh my god. Okay, well I'm reloading this just out of the out of out of self-interest now. I have to see if that's a real thing. I want that smoke now. What the hell? It's stupid as all hell. Yeah, that is a little dumb. I don't know why you would be able to steal that. You should steal the amount of money that the uh that it's worth, right? Like maybe and then maybe duplicate that by like two. Bro, I need to play as the Ogre Kingdoms now? Dude, that's nuts. I've done so many campaigns where they just show up, caravans just show up on your front lawn. So it's like a free, what, 20k delivery? That's fucking nuts. Twenty K that's so much. That's just wait, did I already end my turn at this point? No, I didn't. I ended this turn and then I think the caravan showed up. So maybe if we what if we march since like here? Yeah, there it is. I win. So they'll move like here, right? I have no way of attacking them yet. Hopefully they'll move closer. We'll see. We'll see what they do. Two to three K on landing in your territory. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You do go to war with the faction it belongs to, though, lol. Yeah, but that, who gives a fuck? Cathay are all the way over in Cathay. When have you ever, 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 ever seen a Cathay faction expand their borders and then push out of Cathay? Because me, like, I've never seen that. They just war internally in Cathay and then eventually die. That's kind of like just all they do. Oh, I might be able to reach him. Sneak attack. Come on, come on, come on, come on. They're, are they gonna run? Do they run? <gasps> they don't run. Oh! How much money do we get? Oh! Oh my god, a free 10k. Is it my birthday? Holy shit. Oh my god. <laughs> I can get an extra. I'm going for food. We need food desperately, but. Nice. And we got a berserker sword. Yo, we're fucking rich, dude. And 20 food. Man. Thank you for that fucking tip off holy crap and now we're just at war with a bunch of chinese people halfway across the world win-win <laughs> okay not win-win but <laughs> uh let's uh let's go oh my god i can he i can hear he jinping kicking down my door right now i just lost like all my social credits You may have just earned 10k, but you lost 10k Cathay uh, in social credit. <laughs> yeah. Nothing can stop me, me. Uh, yes! training on for one. Train. Oh, dude, Love training. Stream. Always fun to watch. Plus, OKE okay moments are the best. Aww. If you can, name on rat pickles. Aww. Yeah, all right, I'll do that right now. That's actually sweet. I like that more than Beast Supreme. Pickles is such a cute name for for an animal. Holy it's, shit. It's only. I wish I named my cat Bean. It's something that I'm thinking uh, I've realized recently. I think Bean would have been a great name for him, but knowing your cat's personality in context to what they are named afterwards, you know, maybe, like it doesn't matter. Like you're not going to know what they're going to be like. But my cat is he's just a big old bean. Thanks for the dono, by the way, my dude. I appreciate that very much. And the, uh, Okoy moments, which is just me fucking up, but there you go. Shinny the Pooh <laughs> is very unhappy with you. Dude, he hates that shit, right? Xi Jinping getting compared to Winnie the Pooh, he like, he like, he's like killed multiple people in the street with real guns because they call him Winnie the Pooh. I mean, imagine being that molded over being called Winnie the Pooh. Just imagine like, if... Fucking Donald Trump got pissed that people called him Lumpa Lumpa and he just started gunning people down in the street. I don't think he actually gunned anyone down. That's just a joke. That's just a joke. <laughs> That's just a joke. Bad idea. Um. Oh man. Maybe not Darkland Zox. Don't tempt him. <laughs> Ugh. Well, I mean, maybe he, he will now. He's not pre the president anymore, so he can do whatever he wants. Weirdly. He doesn't have to worry about how he's perceived now. Because who cares? He's just some he's just some fat rich guy again. Okay, raiding the caravans uh, was an integral part of boosting my ghost campaign. 
I'm sorry, did you need to boost your fucking Gorse campaign? <laughs> what? He's so strong. Gorse is like the strongest dude in the whole game now. Like, legitimately. He has fucking Winds of Death. He has, like, crazy magic buffs, uh, Winds of Magic stuff. Like, especially when he gets his uh, book of Rigor Mortis or whatever the fuck. Die! Oh, easy. Good XP, food, Boss, obviously, hey, because we're in our territories. So we don't need to be We're back up to midi food. 13th scheme unlocked. Is that the growth one? No. Uh, expansion is planning com com thing over province. We need this is for the like food benefit. Plan, uh, expansion is planning. There we go. I'll just I'll subvert two food for one turn to get that. Life is cheap. Ooh. Oh my god, that's actually great. Wow. I wish this applied to, um, to not Skaven Slaves, though, because that's useless. But 8% casualty pollution rate is just nuts. Actually, you know what? Renowned and feared. I want it. I want it. I want that upkeep reduction. Mine all mine. Post-battle loot is always huge. God, I really do need to get a cat cam. My cat's, like, up on my desk right now, and he's climbing all over me. I should just get that cat cam already. Right, buddy? Hold on. He, he grum if I hold him upside down, he grumbles. Hold on. <laughs> ah! I don't know if that came out. <laughs> What's your cat's name? Put your cat on the mic. I'll put my cat on the mic. Uh, he's um he's called Tosho, which means frostbite in Japanese because he's uh, a mitted ragdoll, so he's got like a black black nose. Uh, and he's got like black patches on him and then white patches and stuff. It's like that sad Siamese pattern. <laughs> if you hold me upside down, I'd also be a bit grumpy. It's not holding him upside down. It's like I'm holding him and I just put him on my desk and he like grumbles. He's like fussy. Oh my god. What's our casualty relation rate up to? 14%. Pretty good. Yeah, I will look into getting a cat cam because people keep asking for it in the video suggestions. It's been something that I wanted to do for a while. I can, I'll get it out of the donos from today. Goddamn. Thank you very much. Uh, I really wish training stacked. Like I realize why it doesn't because it could be extremely OP, but fuck you. See, hey, let us stack shit. God, fuck, please. Is there a mod for that stackable um, hero upgrades? Uh, wait, oh wait, how are we doing on two more turns? Five turns until we can get Storm Vermin. Could be anyway in the pro- oh! Wait, Vermin's side the- We get war with the following faction and we get 500, uh, we get a thousand- Wait! Whoa, what? This reward will only be given if the reward is completed within the- within this number of turns. So we got six turns to be at war with them. Leadership we're fighting against greenskins. See, that could be just... Okay, the game's pushing us towards them. Let's just go kill them, right? Fuck it. Uh, and we'll declare war on them next turn. All right, we got a plan. The game is pushing us to an, to an a conclusion, but we're, we'll go with it. If you want to make your lords feel more unique uh, and give them some more personal flair and power, I highly recommend the Legendary Lord Artifacts mod. Every Legendary Lord gets a full unique item set. An item set? That's interesting. The thing is with mods, I always feel like they're they're badly balanced. Oh. Holy shit! That's so far away! Ooh, 20 food. Yep. Take me back to my shit. How do you- how do I- Oh, there we go. Uh, alright. Food generated. Growth. Kind of useless at this point, but there it is. Campaign movement range. That's what I want. It made lose it. Poison weapons. Uh, blade. All right. Let's fight some great skins. ready. Hi, chieftain. Uh, declare war. Wait, can I declare war on... Wait, wait, wait. I could just declare war on them. 
for Eyebiter, right? Join war against the Docklands Orcs for 290 bucks. There we go. Nice. Now I'm at war with them. I get my 500. I get my uh, declare war on behalf and getting going attack him. What's the full province for this? Oh, it's just a two province settlement. Nice. Hey, hey, yo. Let's okay. Fingers crossed. I don't get fucked by bug eyes down here. The high elf dragon fucker. Um. The uh shit. What's she called? Miao Ying Simp. The Miao Ying Simp. The ultimate simp. Maybe we could do this too. What's the actual army for this? Does it tell you? Oh, here it is. Uh, it says that it's only an Arachnorok spider to, and a bunch of goblins and shit, but it never tells you the reinforcements, so obviously there's going to be reinforcements. Let's just wait until we have a storm room and stack, and we'll take that on. Yes, my tail. From what I understand, the Lucky Skull Helm is actually a really good item now. It used to be dog shit, now it's good. Oh my god, another caravan! Oh my god, another caravan! Yes! Yes! It's Dingo Ahua! <laughs> what a name! Dingo Ahua! That's, that's the noise I make when I get a free 10k and 20 food. Hello, Koi. Um, other than one or two that give strong abilities like Katarin getting 500 points of barrier, they are all very well balanced. I sometimes forget which ones are modded and which are CA made. Lol. Oh, I'll look into that. That might actually be, have been a fun little addition uh, for campaigns in the future. Nice, nice, nice. Storm Berman. Uh, we got all your unique buildings. Oh, yeah. Okay, right out the gate. Fucking generators. Always good. Wait. No, that's good. Grey Hag, Dark Hold. Grey Hag, obviously. Way closer. Dude, we're set. Dude, we're fucking stacked. 21k, 2k. We're about to get another 10k, maybe? That's insane. <laughs> You're fucking free money. Bruh, 32,000. <laughs> we're fucking rich. One way. Yeah, but that just, okay, that just reminds me of the, um, that, uh, you know when that, they, they had that thing on the news about a plane going down in China, and they were like, uh, we have the names of the pilots here, they are, a uh, holy fuck, <laughs> we too low, <laughs> and they just, they, they didn't catch on, how do you not catch on to that, it's unreal, bang ding ow, <laughs> Something wrong. <laughs> <laughs> so good, man. I, I imagine how many people got fired for that. So many people, and you know that the guy who fired him didn't see it either. Knows that he wouldn't have seen it, but still fired them. Uh, more defense. No and. Oh, I hate this so much. Oh, ogres. Ooh, ogre mugs might actually be a good, um... They need to rework this, by the way. What I'm hoping is... Okay, so here's this... Here's what I'm thinking. CA are going to do a, an over, a, a overhaul for the, for the mercenaries, right? I think that the ogre kingdoms are going to get a DLC mixed with a bunch of other factions way down the line, a little bit of an overwork. And I think that they're going to get an expanded available mercenary section where you get paid when they recruit mercenaries. And also, um, you, you have access to like, to, what do you call them? Uh, man eaters. You'll be able to recruit man eaters and shit. An ogre hall? Exactly, yes. All right, let's get, we'll get some ogres just so we have some, right? Uh, let's combine these boys. Get a stack of them. Alright. And now we got some heavy hitters and some heavy eaters. And okay, so his stretch actually good? Seems like he's popping off, but what's the strat? Um, the str I guess the strat is killing a bunch of Chinese people for a shit ton of money. I guess that's the new strat. Wow, we're selling 30 fucking K. We're just gonna be rid- we're sad! We're just cheating at this point. 34k! So, if you kill- apparently if you kill a, ch a caravan, you get 10k. And just here, we've had two caravans show up, because this is apparently a through line. You know, they- they- they 
they're over, they start over here and then they move all the way through the mountains and they go up here, over here, whatever. If you see a, a, a Cathay Caravan, basically just attack them, kill them, because you get you get 10k in the, in the early game. And then apparently you get more late, late game. Crazy. Fucking crazy. Like, we're just completely rich already. What? Valley Defeat? You know what? I can see it. Uh, mostly because we've just got shitty clan rats, but also, like, we don't have a caster or any way of, like, killing them en masse. Maybe we just, like, retreat and come back with, um... Because their infantry are just better than ours, like, whole ass. We have Devastating Flanker, not going to be useful in a siege. Maybe we just bail, recruit Storm Vermin, and come back. Because by the time we get back, we're going to be able to recruit a fuck ton of them. And I don't want to waste... Yeah, I'm just going to do that, actually. That's a good idea. We've got thanks for all the amazing content. I we have, have a playlist money. of your Doom's Tech video songs hey, on permanent rotation when I'm playing. More hey, please. hey, hey. Hey, well, dude, I'm working on uh, 20 uh, Doom Wheels right now. I I've got like a, a huge proportion of the video finished so more content coming for sure for sure Craven um and sheesh yeah i've been getting way back into warhammer 3 lately i don't know why i know that the game's been, it's been dead in the water with no patches for a hot minute but like but yeah man yeah i don't know it's weird how you just like swings around about us i just del del delved back in been having a blast and then when content hits, we'll be right in the pocket, right there, ready to go. They might get baited out. Oh, there's no way. I didn't even realize they had an army in there. And Okoy, if you siege and they sally out... Oh, yeah, fuck. That's a good point. I could have just, like, sieged them out. I want to recruit Stormworm, though. We're, like, we're right there. We can do it now. You can win that fight easily? Yeah, probably, maybe. Plan of Mage. God, there's a lot of... <laughs> what I've noticed is a lot of factions die very frequently when you're playing a major faction type. One more turn and we can get Storm Roman. They will. I'm a preemptively delete my entire clan rats to get even more money per turn because big brain. And by big brain, I mean we're probably going to get attacked now. <laughs> I didn't think about that. Wait, can we get anything else? I should have gone with another military building because I probably could have... Oh, what? Eshin Sorcerers are tier 4 unit? What the fuck? That's fucking dumb. And Triads? Okay, Triads, if... I'm sorry, but if Triads are going to be a tier 4 infantry unit, they need to be, like, double as good as they are right now. Like, you can get away with it with Death Runners, but fucking Eshin Triads have, like, nothing going for them. What were they thinking? I mean, on paper, they're exactly the same thing. Like, almost identical. Interesting. That's that's weird. Cheat and somehow get Ikit's faction while being Tretch. Uh, I'll be able to do that if he dies. If he dies, I'll uh, absorb them like a, a amorphous blob. Anything going on in diplomacy? No. Everybody kind of hates us. Uh, even these guys hates us. Even though we've had a lot of war with... God, they still don't like us because we fuck with the Moon Hellers. Fine, whatever. All right, one more turn. Let's recruit some stuff. Adokoi, why would you... Why would Sensor Bearer be T5 in the first place? Dude, there's so much wrong with the recruitment trees and tiers for certain units. It's just nuts. Like, a lot of high-tier cavalry for factions that are not good units are, like, tier 4, tier 5 recruitment. and But they're terrible. Like, nobody's gonna... It's like, why would you recruit bad cavalry when at that same uh building rank you can recruit like hydras and shit you know what i mean or at earlier ranks in some factions it just doesn't make any sense they need to put the really strong single entity shit way at the top and put like high tier cavalry way lower and shit or stuff that's not actually that good you know in my opinion all right here we go we got ah oh, dude we can recruit them at single silver rank too all right and they are still 200 a piece though, so this is gonna be a big, beefy, expensive army. I'm gonna get rid of these Death Runners too, because not a lot of what we're gonna be doing applies to them. Wait, let me check. Uh, Clan Rats, Storm Vermin, Death Runners. Oh, okay, so that applies to them. And then, Skaven Slaves, Clan Rats, and Storm Vermin. 
Nah, see, whip smart gutter wise are in different categories. Night runners, death runners. Wow, interesting. They're in like the range category. Yeah, death runners are not scave are uh, not treachy enough. Also, should we kill? Sh should we be keeping the ogres? Oh, they get devastating flanker. Oh, that's actually cool. No immunity to psychology though, but they also count as siege attackers, which we don't need. I feel like a unit of ogre bulls is keep ogre. Keep the ogres. You will keep them for a little bit of flavor. Fuck it. Uh, it means less recruitment on our part. And then we'll just like get a nice split. Mostly, I feel like I want to say that the spear variants are better. Would I be wrong? They've got armor piercing. I it should definitely be an even split. Okay, four, five, six, 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 eight, seven, eight. Yeah, that's about right. Sweet. We could just do the quest battle, like, right out the gate. See if these guys are good. Stop putting... Putting levels on them. Need to get those, uh... Unit speed buffs, too, though. That's... Oh, fuck. I need hit and run. Shut the number. That's useless. All right, I'm going to start recruiting hit and run. The sooner we get that, the better. 10% extra speed for our infantry on top of everything else. Oh, we're gonna be so stacked! Oh, boy! I don't call it. Death Runners with Flanker gives them 400 to 900 gold value when they use when used right in battle. Hmm, that's a good point. But also, are they Storm Vermin? I don't think so. You will be... I'm trying to go for, like, a specific thing in this... In this, uh campaign normal storm vermin have nearly as much armor piercing if i remember correctly while having better stats are you sure though Chieftain of the deep warrens. let me check nine armor piercing damage and 29 base damage versus i can't check because i don't have them yet <laughs> we'll check in a minute man it's weird not having to worry about money even slightly we're so rich <laughs> it's just ridiculous um Oh, maybe I should have built the clan armory in a secondary building. Huh. Um, just fuck it. Fuck it. Dwarfs are still alive, which means that bug eyes down south is still having trouble, which is good for us. Mm. Albert's hold the line, swords got hold kill counts. Ogres are infantry, fast ogres. When it comes to Rictus, bonus for clan rats and storm romans, it's the plus one base damage bonus percentage or not. It's not a pro no, it's just a flat, it's just a flat one. So it's not, a maximum of nine. I'm pretty sure. Plus one armor and base damage per unit experience rank for all clan rats and storm romans. Yeah, so it's a, so like at silver, they have 38. And then they would have what? 32? 30, 34? 34, because unit rank 4. So it's a plus 9, which for base weapon damage, pretty fucking good. At like, go genuinely good. Oh. Uh, I should realize I hadn't changed the name of our, uh. Our boy. Alright, we just gotta. Cast some turns in now, I guess. Dude, it's so strange not having to worry about money this much. I don't think I've been this rich this early on with any faction in a long time. God, lesson learned. Kill kill nearby trader caravans the second they show up. Freeze the main settlement for an advanced military building. Yeah, yeah, yeah. True, 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 true. But then again, you're taking away a financial building from a minor settlement, so it's kind of like give and take. Missile focus... Focus these Lord fucking Craven. nuts. Oh, oh god, this army. This is gonna be great. This turn 17 and we got a full Storm Vermin army. This is uh very strong. Uh Eshen Darlings? What a weird name for a fucking mission. Warg? 
Is anybody else bothered in Lord of the Rings when Saruman says wag riders? Like he's from fucking Boston. Like everything he says is correct. Maybe it is wa wag, but he's like send out your wag riders. And I'm like, <laughs> like, like he's from Boston. Does that throw anyone else off? That's such a weird thing to say. I rewatched Lord of the Rings recently and he said, he goes like up to the, the, I can't remember his name. But he's like, send out your wag riders. And I'm like, what? <laughs> Hey! <laughs> What's the dude's name? I gotta look him up. Hold on. Wog Commander Lord of the Rings. Uh, Shaku. Dude, fuck yeah. Shaku was the, the, the fucking best. Wog, you never noticed that? Yeah, he just said, hold on. Let me see if I can find it. Because, like... Uh, no, that's not it. Come on, that's got to be it. Uh, the forest of Fangorn lies. Oh, dude, this movie's so good, man. I don't I can't find it. It, it if somebody knows it then then look it up But basically he's like he turns into like he has a Boston accent out of nowhere I know it's not a Boston accent. Maybe that's how it's pronounced, but fuck it just took me out of it I was like that's not right <laughs> at all Just hits the ear wrong hits the ear at a weird angle Clan rats can have a weapon strength uh, of a slave as bonus added to their own that sounds powerful Genuinely, I think that this army has a really good chance of being extremely- No! Why? Oh, because of treaties with clan rooms and the Lamian Sisterhood. And 30 of uh, aversion. Okay. It's wogging time. <laughs> I love the bit where Saruman turns to the, uh, to the Uruk and says, It's wogging time. Oh. Okay. All right, now we're getting shot on uh, on all fronts here a little bit. Not super cool for us. Clan Scrat. Clan Scrat? Where the fuck is Clan Scrat? Oh my god, another caravan. Oh, yes. Gad the Seasoner. I tell you what, I'm gonna I'm put a garrison on Darkhold because garrisons still give you income generated. But we can also actually defend our towns. I'm probably gonna do the same thing with this actually Yeah, I'm gonna delete the scavenging pile To, to, to build a secondary no wait, wait wait there's no point because it's up in the north side of a territory anyway Doc Hall needs a garrison though for sure and also we can more than afford another army even if it's just a, a trash banner Um what do you guys think? Gracier, Warlock Master, Warlock, or Master Assassin? As soon as I see like two or three of one of these suggestions. Warlords I think are the worst. Warlock Masters are fucking great. Graciers are amazing and Master Assassins are okay. Play Gracier. Gracier, Warlock, Warlock, Gracier. That's two for each. Spellboy, that's both. Strong assassins seem pretty fun. Uh, Master assassins are great if you're playing as Clan Ashen. Warlock, Plague Boy, Plague Seer. I guess we'll go Gray Seer. There's slightly more for that, and also I like him slightly more. They're just good, good looking, good fellas. Ambush success chance plus 25%. Damn, dude. That's really good. Maybe we could get him to the point where he's just ambushing like a beast. That's easily the best one. Holy shit. Wait, what lore is he? Oh, he looks... Dude, I love that Butcher's Cleaver thing they get. Plague. Okay, Plague is good. Uh, and Graciers are cool looking. What do we call them? Uh, the Great Horn E Rats. As in the Great Horn Rat, but the, you, get the, you get the joke. I've already beaten into the ground. Now I arrive. Have slaves, bow, bow. What's, what's cheap and cheerful? Maybe Skaven Slaves, nice cheap Skaven Slaves stack. But if we're going to see, this is the problem for me, is Skaven Slaves are basically just so much worse than in every way than Clan Rats, but Clan Rats are only like twice the price. 
And but when you're dealing with prices that low, you may as well just go clan rats. Like there's almost no reason to recruit Skaven slaves. They're not cheap enough. Wait, unless you get no, I'm thinking of the uh, the warlords. Warlords get life is cheap, but these guys don't get life is cheap. Hmm. Maybe we just buff Skaven Slaves with numbers beyond counting. Because we already have a couple of things for, for them anyway. It's still not worth it. It's just not worth it. It's still not worth it. Because look, we, we're getting clan rat buffs this way and stuff. Recruit ram for clan rats. Clan rats. Alright. Quest battle. Let's go. This will be a good way to test these guys out, I think. Pyriki Victory? Okay. I'm gonna give the melee attack to the ogres because they're weaker than everything else. All right. Adokoi, keep in mind, you uh, get offensive an offensive bonus each time you face a war declaration. Yes, good point, good point, good point. I need to focus on declaring war on a faction when I'm right outside their gates. That is uh, a good point. Clan rats get bonus over experience anyway. Yes, dude, true. Also, yeah. Clan rats are a better better pick, just in general. Hey, I'm back. Did you stop the stream like I asked? Oh, I'm sorry. I'm going to end stream. Hold on. Eat my fucking balls, dude! Clan rats get... Yeah, bonus experience. Oh, here we go. Dude, he loves grooming, doesn't he? Unaware of our approach. Look, see how the blockheaded fools send their patrols away. Nice. I don't remember doing this this battle. I don't remember it having voiced either. We attack while they are weak. We leave only their bones. <laughs> nice. All right, fucking Russian. We gotta get there as soon as possible. What's our speed like? 34 speed with the debuff. Kind of like 40 out. 34 speed for a uh, heavily armored infantry is is not that bad though. We gotta get our ogres onto their. Uh, wait, oh yeah, there they are. Doom Diver catapults. That's what I want to shut down. Wait, I don't have any uh, underway uses. Seriously? That's cringe. Oh. My whiskers twitching. Doom wheel. Uh. There we go. Hungry. Find a man. No range isn't gonna be great. Maybe we can sprinkle in some shit later. We'll be fine. More chaos. Oh. Are those armored chaos? Wait, what the fuck? Armored chaos trolls in a green skin army? That's bullshit. Okay, we're just gonna brute force through. Okay, overwhelm them! Ooh, how are we gonna take out their, um, Ragnarok spider? I'm just gonna have to send, uh, the boys at it. Uh, I need anti-lodge on these guys. Oh, wait, what's attacking us? A, a Night Goblin war boss? Get in here! Oh, he has better stats than I thought he did. Get on it! Um, we're okay, we're okay. Our assassin's kind of getting borked a little bit. That's not cool, that's not super cool. We're shooting through them now pretty good. Wait, what's dying? Oh my god, the fucking Doom Wheel! Holy shit! Your desire. Fucking archers, dude! Backwards. Eat my fucking nuts! Yes, yes. How we doing? We take it out near Rock Rock? Not even slightly. Fuck me. Okay. Go, go, get on it. Good stuff. Good stuff. Oh, we're gonna lose that Doom Wheel. That's nuts. What's the damage on these things? 500... 2,000. Yeah, they're really not doing all that much. It must have been the archers, right? 800. 
Oh, the Arachnorok, maybe? Rip Doom Wheel? Oh, the Wheel of Cheese just got shut down. Very uncool. Doom Wheel! Heisen, hurry! Attack from rear! I tell you what. Slay enemy foes! Uh, all right, they're coming from over here. Just a bunch of crap. Just a whole mess of crap. I'm not worried about. Hmm. That I'm worried about a little bit. There's some stuff in there. No. Oh. Oh, they just got a running. <laughs> they were those um. What are they called? The guys that hop to those uh. Poison globe ears. I thought they had poison globe ears for a second there. I did shit a little. Oh, they've got a fucking dude. I love these rat ogres, mutant rat ogres, and uh, these guys are just so cool. Oh, they're gonna eat. No, you're gonna kill my ogre bulls. Get out of here. Looking for me. Ooh. Oh, those are death runners. That's why they're chewing through my my dudes. All right, let's get in there. Then leap. Fuck it, push on them. I need to use that devastating flanker, but it's difficult to when they're not that fast. Move, move. We need faster boys. Faster boys. Move. Off we go. Quick, quick. Scamper forward. Oof, oof. Massive L. Okay. <laughs> I don't remember him chasing that down. Fuck. Kill gas. Oh, yes. Yeah, this could be going worse. The general's dead. Oh, no, he came back. The general. Oh, no, he didn't come back. Well, I'm just gonna chase him off. The Doom Wheel's fucked anyway. Oh, those are Cave and Slave Slingers. I can just ignore them pretty much. Oh, we're good, we're good. Those death runners have been. Oh, wow. I don't know why the death runners are so strong. It's just that minus 50% armor, right? Because clan rats don't. I mean, uh, Stormer and <coughs> inherently don't have great stats, not great melee attack. Uh, they'll get better. No. We don't have any uh, army wide bots for them at all right now. What what? Alright, ride him off, ride him off. Stupid greenskins with their fucking leadership. Oh he did come back. He actually did. <laughs> Fuck. Let's see the boys crunch. Guts Come on, boys. boys. Hit some shit. Guts out, boys. Ah, oh, I love me some ogres. Doom wheel. This is messy, but we got the we got the unit quality to, to be fine here. Their general is duking it out with a single unit of stone vermin, <laughs> just miles away. <laughs> this is a, a really chaotic fight, actually. Now, you got any generals Scabby left? There we go. Focus down the leaders, I guess. Great, great. Yes. Eat, fight. God, they just they just don't give up. Whoa, pretty sure you can't say stupid green skins on stream. <laughs> uh, at least they're green and not any other color that actually exists. I wouldn't say the same thing if we were fighting like Skaven. Yes, yes. I don't know. Skaven. Well that's more of a first situation. God, how are they not broken yet? Now, yes! Master of What's left? They've literally it's just gutter runners and shit. I am in dire need of some mobile units. Some like real speed stuff. 
This is why I'm not usually that down Snakes with infantry team stacks for shaming. <laughs> now move! Council's command! The storm vermin! Alright, we just fast forward from here. We just gotta break like two units and we're good. Unless they all come back. <laughs> you shit heels! Just quit! I have won! Yes, yes, etc. Oh my god. What is with the leadership and they coming back? My units don't do this crap. Finally. Oh! Oh, damn, woo, 179, 188, 132, 287 kills and 17,000 value. Wow, I mean, we took some casualties, but we kind of fucked. Maybe the swordsmen are better than the spearmen. Although, for this it is, because they don't have anything heavily armored, but if I'm fighting anything heavily armored, the swordsmen are going to be like way worse. Fun fact, that okay, as long as... The slurs that insult such what's faith, species, or culture, it's fine for YouTube's guidelines. For these reasons, I recommend everyone start insulting the French. <laughs> uh, those things are real, dude. I'm like 60-70% sure that French are real. They're called Bretonians, though. So maybe we just rip on the Bretonians. We're good on food. I'm gonna take the, re the replay. Nice. Does everyone also agree that regiments of renown need to be uh, available from a lower level? Like, they're so fucking useless. Like, oh cool, now I have a unit of clan rats that are slightly better. Now, okay, they're slightly better with Eshin because of the whole, you know, rank thing. So they have 39, 36. And sure, I'll recruit them into my second Let army. But like, screen. are we putting them on the same level Mighty as... Am I, like, I, I, it, it's gonna be like turn 160 before I can get some of this shit. And I could already get Storm Vermin. They need to be dropped down by like five levels in my opinion. R regiments of renown are never useless. No, but what I mean is when you get them. Like, I have a full army of Storm Vermin. What am I gonna do with a unit of clan rats? Like, not if you're fighting all the time? I mean, we fought it pretty decently. Victory, I'm hey, here we go. Okay, charge bonus for, for uh, plus 10 for Storm Vermin. Treacherous Raiders, passive ability in a 35 meter radius. Get a lot of stuff when we're winning, which is going to be a lot. Ambush success chance, another 20%. That's going to be fucking insane. Missile resistance, 10%. Speed for Clan Rats and Storm Vermin, 20%. Speed and camp. Wow. Okay, it's, uh, I, now it's I can see why this is starting to get... Regen. Wow. Regen for, for Tretch? Has he always had that? Hold on. Has he always had regen when getting coming back? Or is that part of the rework? Because that's that seems insane. Um, so then we'll get this. If we get Ancient Cunning Master of Guile, we're gonna be just ambush gods. Think so, yeah. No, always there. Wow. I really have pl haven't played him much. I think a lot of people played him for the first time, played Tretch for the first time back when he had very little mechanics and just kind of wrote him off forever. So I feel like I'm playing him for the first time, almost. I'm pretty sure I've been duped into playing him before the one stream. And then I had such an issue with him. I think the first time we did a randomized stream with randomized factions, and I really didn't want to play as Tretch, so everybody voted Tretch for the meme. And then he was terrible, and halfway through the campaign I was so bored I quit out, and I just restarted with a different faction. I think that I think I remember that. So that says a lot about Tretch. Adokoi, he always have it. Except the multiple, he don't. Yeah. Nothing can stop me. Yeah, but that's a lot of generals are like that, where they just don't get some of their high tier shit. Uh. Okay, this is gonna bankrupt us a little bit, but you know what? When, when we're selling a, a bank, uh, a bank, banking amount of thirty-seven k, I don't think it fucking matters at all. Look, can we go? Can we ally with this guy? Who still don't like us. Still unfriendly. Damn. All right. 
Whatever, your loss. Caravan? I know, I know, I know, I saw the caravan. I know, wait, oh, did it move? I can't reach it, but if it's nearby, I'll attack it. Why does your game look weird? Uh, it might be my, um, my, I have like sharpening on. I have a uh, HDR that makes the game a little brighter. I have DPX on that increases the uh, contrast. And then I have vibrance on, maybe that's it. Wait, did I just disable one and then not turn it back on? I feel like I have more on than this. I just have a little bit of sharpening on the stuff that just gives the game a little bit higher quality. HDR. Did I have HDR on? There you go. Makes the game pop in my opinion. You know, more contrast, more color, more color, and then a little bit of sharpening. Makes it look good. You can read all of the icons a little bit better, or at least I can. Helps me out. Makes the game look good. HDR, thank you. Lucky Skull Helm. So, 10% physical resistance, 15% ambush success chance again. Oh my god. We're going to be gods. Really? So wait, so 15% plus 20% plus 30%. What the fuck? What? And then... We might be able to... Yeah, another 5% for eyes everywhere? <laughs> Holy shit! We're gonna be up there with like, um, uh, Clan Eshin. That's crazy. Um, no. You know what? I don't. There's a lot of factions that have declared war on us. Maybe it, it will be a good time to just. I don't know. Build, gar build garrison buildings. I probably should. Especially for Skaven. They give you money. And a defensive supplies and stuff. Oh no, the caravan! No! Come on! Maybe it's still there. Maybe we, it's just a little bit further along. Maybe we can still snatch it. Ooh, oh my god. Oh, the ogres are coming out in force. Let's go. Bone Chew, Ronaldo, and Eye Biter, Nog Flag, and Gad the Seasoner. These, these orcs are going to be so seasoned. Wait a minute, but I wanted to take this. I wanted this, you fucking ogres. Ooh, okay, this is actually kind of a, a dilemma, because I don't want to have to kill ogres, but I want this. This is part of my province. I deserve this. <laughs> what do we do? Fuck. Um. Let the bears it might be time for war with the ogres. Adokoi is now a true tretch simp. I mean, I he's better. We'll see. Adokoi, I imagine you don't know, but you could have killed them if you you're at war with the caravans faction and ambush stands in their path. You have like a fifteen to twenty percent chance to snag them. Fifteen to twenty percent chance. Eyebiter is a war with several ogre factions, so it might be worth the risk. L let me check. Loyal again? Was this guy's loyalty down? I'll give him a bell polisher so somebody can polish his bell. Uh, let's check on that. Uh, no. They're at war with um, the Darklands Orcs and the Caravan of Blue Roses. But, hmm, that's it. Peerless. Draclacoven. Alright. Yeah, not so much. Just remember, it's an ogre eat ogre wolf. But they're not, I'm not ogres, we're rats. Hey, yo, dude, look at this. What? 
Kara's a chaotic have been destroyed by fucking green skins. No way. <laughs> That's amazing. God, if Warhammer One players could see us now, fucking Skarsnik taking down the dwarves. Holy shit. Edokoi, ogres are just slightly less stinky troll meat. Fuck you. That's mean. I'll tell you what, why don't we wait here? In raid stance. Get some free. What? Is there being sieged? Man. Well, might as well go and camp and stand so I can uh, replenish my shit. Oh, nice. I forgot about that. Right performed. And then we get back on the, the uh, food grind. Good shit. All right. <clears throat> I'll wait a turn to see if they take it. I'm, I don't like how the AI just fucking siege a town for like 50 turns. The AI still do that shit. I thought they, they released a hotfix that's supposed to fix that. Oh! Oh no! <laughs> oh shit! Oh! Well, this is about to be a betrayal. Wait, I should've- No, why did I help them? Fuck! I fucked up. Hold on. I fucked up. <laughs> I fucked up! I fucked up! I didn't mean to join the fight! I hit the wrong button. I just out of habit. Fuck! I need to bail out of the battle, my bad. No, okay, moment! Uh, yes! This was a regular moment. Oh, mean boss of Chungus boys. I bad at rat what do? <laughs> oh, mean boss of Chungus boys. I bad at rat what do? Um, prioritize food. Try and keep your shit in plentiful. Uh, occupy everything at rank. Uh, uh, settlement. I uh, think he too for the most part. Um, I'm not sure. Skaven, I've Skaven are just second nature to me. I played them so much. They're good boys. They're good, good, strong boys. Thank you for the dono. Uh, uh I just sort of like do a lot of what I did with this faction. I guess this is the, easily the best way to play them. It's not even debatable. Oh, attack caravans. <laughs> <laughs> That's my new tip for everybody that I just learned is Attack the shit out of any caravan that you see because it's not gonna matter and the amount of money that you get will set you up for for like 50 turns To be good at Skaven think like a Skaven exactly think like a sneaky little disgusting like plague ridden rat Nice What do you want? Treaty pact? Oh, oh, they want a peace treaty. Oh. No, <laughs> I got I got enough money. I don't need your peace. Oh, they took some bad casualties. Now it's my time to shine. This is exactly what I'm talking about. This is what we call in the business call a rat move. <laughs> you run in and you just you rat fuck. Oh man, what? Here victory and we lose our ogres. Unacceptable. I'm gonna switch this to uh, some stone vermin though, because these are gonna be a bread and butter for this with that anti-lodge bonus. 53 weapon strength, we're getting better. Um, oh, just gonna have to play it. Just gonna have to play it. Wait. Wait, 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 wait. What? Call me Lord Here we go. There we go. Ambush, that's what I'm talking about. You're fucking dead! Food? Yes, unit yes. experience? The unit experience plus 100 is gonna be huge for us to get those ranks up. 3 XP. Punish troops. 3, good stuff. Wait. Ambush the outside army. Yeah, exactly. 
my thoughts exactly. Like, I gotta remember, you can just press, like, press the, uh, arrow keys. Oh, what? No, you can't. Oh, yeah, yeah, it's these two. Wait, why is that not working? Oh, there we go. Uh, pickles. Aw, oh, pickles. Alright, that should be a much easier fight. That's what I'm talking about. And now it's ours. I'll give out it too. We can afford it with the food. Uh... No unique building thingies. So just some virtual stability bullshit. Oh, wow. Okay, the eyebiters were definitely worth fighting because they own, like, a fuck ton of their territory. So now we can just occupy all of this eyebiter stuff and then go down south. We haven't had water cleared us on us from down south, but we should be fine. Oh, the ambush success chance. <laughs> yes! I'm actually gonna pump a little bit into it. I want feared and respected like now because another six percent weapon strength we, we're gonna have like 50 weapon strength base and then also I think they have frenzy no they don't never mind I don't know what I'm thinking but I stats regardless mm. more food in it out Oh man, we gotta fight ogres. <sighs> I don't wanna do it, but we're gonna have to. I got a question. If I streamed some. St I f okay, so, so what I've realized recently is Twitch has a policy for um, playing copyrighted music on your stream. And I don't know if you, it's because like some people aren't partnered so it doesn't matter or they don't care about the stream not being able to make view revenue or something. I don't exactly know how it works, but I've seen a lot of people streaming on Twitch just playing copyrighted music, like chill as fuck playing, you know, Mastodon and like fucking metal bands and like just copy, just totally copyrighted music, like completely copyrighted stuff. How does that work? Can I, if I stream on Twitch, can I just play like my fucking Spotify playlist and it's totally chill? Because I, I've made an Okoy Spotify playlist of like songs that I like and shit. They mute a section of the VOD. Oh, I mean, I'm not going to be really using the stream VODs. I would just stream on Twitch. And if anybody wanted to watch, I just enjoy streaming. Copyright is automatic, my man. You don't need to register it. Well, yeah, but like copyright on YouTube, I lose all the revenue and then sometimes they take a cut of donos and shit, which is the real problem. So I got to cut out little bits and stuff like that. But how does that work for like, uh, I don't know. I'm just wondering how people play copyrighted stuff all the time. Pretty sure you just need to delete the VOD. Ah. Oh. I think they have to separate so it doesn't come up in the in the VOD. Weird. Weird. Oh. Raise or sack the fox out of the bone gulch. Hey, perfect. We got missions to go down south. That's good. Oh no. Okay. Oh, they really don't like us though. Because of treaties. I'll give you treaties if you don't fucking attack me. Chosen. I'm actually scared of Skostic. Look at the amount of territory this fucking guy owns. Holy shit. How did he take these? Wait, he didn't have any of these. He took all three of these towns in like a single turn. What? I'm scared of Skostic, man. What's his strength rank? Strength rank three. What the fuck? I'm gonna buy a non-aggression pack. 9,000. Okay, no, sir. Thank you. No. Get fucked. Fuck that. I will risk having war declared on me before I fuck with that shit. I don't know what are the difficulties. Uh, very hard slash normal. Normal battle difficulty, very hard campaign difficulty, as per usual. That's just kind of my baseline. That's <laughs> a battle I come after. <laughs> what a coward. 
Apparently, Tretch gets off on watching other people do battle for him. That's like his kink. You go to battle, I come after. <laughs> uh, I'm just gonna go full in on the buffs. 62 weapon strands, let's go. <laughs> That's crazy. That's really fucking high. 62 base weapon strength with 10 armor piercing. 54 with the spear variant. Wow, but they get 16 bonus versus large. 17 bonus versus large. Oh, and we don't even have the speed. Wait, 46 speed. Let's go. I, I didn't even think about that. Because of the vanished thing, 20% for clan rats and storm vermin and missile resistance. So we're, we're running... How much missile resistance? 20% and probably just 20% again, right? Or less because they don't have shields. No, wait, that's 20% base plus another... 35%. So that's 55% missile resistance on our shielded guys. Wow. My Raiders. At least when they've got their shields up, it, it is. When they're like running at people. Tretch might be cracked. He might actually be cracked now. I might be a Tretch fan. I might have done a 180 on the Tretch man. I might like him now. Demon Don't tell anyone. I wish campaign faction-wide, like, buffs and shit applied to units in garrisons. I think it's one of the best things that I've seen done in Troy, is that any buffs that happen to your, uh... Any buffs that you get out of your research tree also applies to your garrisons. Which is just... You would think would be just a no-brainer, right? That should happen. It's a faction-wide buff. Okay, uh, was goaded with the sauce. Apparently, Tretch is goaded with the sauce. And those Storm Vermins are just silver rank yet? Yeah, dude. Plus, I don't even have the rest of the buffs for them. Like, think about this. Let me, like, if I'm spitballing, we've got the rest of the research tree buffs, right? Which is another, like, 5 melee attack, 5 melee defense, plus the 10% uh, uh, movement speed for infantry. So, on top of what they've already got, which is probably going to bring up to about 50 speed. And then also, uh, we've got to factor into the red line. So, that's another rank of this. So, that's 9% weapon strength, which is going to bring it up. 6 uh, melee attack instead of 4. And then, when they get to the gold rank, uh, of triple gold rank, they're going to have 9 more armor and 9 weapon strength, uh, weapon strength. And also, on top of that, they're going to have another 5 missile attack and another 15% missile resistance and leadership. So, they're basically going to be almost unbreakable, immune to psychology, have a, an insane amount of speed for flanking with Devastating Flanker, and a stupid amount of weapon strength. And there's 160 of them, and they have a shit ton of health. Oh, this army actually might be worth a video. Like, no joke. This could be a video, uh, Doomsday, at this rate. Arukoi, would you say that the chance to snag every early game caravan makes the Darklands worth it? Yeah, pretty much. I, I mean, that's a stupid amount of money. Like, it, I, I never attack them when I'm playing Ogre Kingdoms too, which I'm absolutely going to do from now on. I did an Ogre Kingdoms campaign recently with all of the uh, Ogre Kingdoms mods, like the Bruiser mod and shit like that. Hell of a lot of fun. Can we make a... Can we peace out with anybody? Goldtooth! All right, I'm gonna pay this guy uh, 1900 you know what 171 and then we also get some good stuff. We're set on stupid amounts of money Ooh, I could peace out with the dark lens orcs though for like a fat stack and then I wouldn't have to worry about them attacking me from the north I'm gonna do that just for the sole fact Give me money. I don't need another aggression pack because he's not gonna declare war on me again, although it's free I don't need military access. Wait, hold on. East Treaty. Money. What about a non-aggression pack? Then money. 4,000. Fuck it, I'll take it. We don't need a unified province, it's fine. Hey, okay, get a chance to try out the new SFO update yet? No, I have not, but I was thinking about my next stream, I would do SFO Ogres. Uh, I was just going to do a whole regular ass Greasus SFO campaign to see how it is. And it'll be my first time doing it. Uh, it'll be my first time playing SFO since like 2018 for Warhammer 2. So. So yeah, sure. I could do that. Uh, Okoy, how come you never play in those tourneys, the turn house? Oh, I do sometimes. I'm just. 
not very good at the <laughs> I'm not good at this game. I'm not good at multiplayer. I've tried though. Like I've um I've played in some of them before. I just jump in on them occasionally. I'll answer them. It's more of a time thing, and then I also I don't check the total tavern enough. Oh no, don't declare war on me. Ah Yeah, alright, I'll take it. I, I don't want that smoke right now. I do not want that smoke. I'm busy. I'm a, I'm a, I'll take his bribe for now. We're down 28k. Like, oh my god, he just confederated. Oh. <laughs> wow, no fucking way. He just became strength rank one, right? Strength rank two. Oh my god. Does he like me? Does he like me at least? Okay, he doesn't like me. He's technically almost more threatening than, than Skosnik is. That's not great for us. Alright, you know what? Listen, I'm just gonna knuckle down and start taking stuff. I have to. Uh, oh, nice. Clan Rictus. Hey, suspiciously. Okay, this is when it starts getting good for these guys. Nice. Ward save. Tretch might actually be good now. <laughs> Just extra 10% ward save. Crazy leadership for the front lines. Verminous Valor, extremely fun. Dude, 19 casts of Verminous Valor is so good. Character leadership aura actually might be kind of based. But we're gonna go with the uh, leaderships. She's loyal, obviously. I'm just gonna make him more stacked, I think, for now. Is it safe? Has anybody ever seen the the fucking bloody hands confederate Skosnik? This is like my first time ever seeing it. Isn't Grimgore uh, rank one? Usually, yeah. Yep. He's always they they I don't know what they fucking did in the most recent patch, but Grimgore is an absolute fucking monster. He's so he's he's back to how he was when they when the Greenskins rework first hit in Warhammer 2. Like he's back up there in like tier fucking number one, whatever. That's oh that's another reason that I want to play the SFO mod, because you can make certain factions weaker. Fuck me, he's got like a full Oh god. Can I can I peace out with him preemptively? 11,000. Oh my god. Oh god. He's gonna clap her cheeks so fucking hard. Like, this army's good, but I don't know if it's good enough to, to take him out. To take out Grimgore and. Oh my god, I just fucking realized we're on we're on the ultimate end times event. So there, every single faction, including the Greenskins, is going to get like 10 free armies. I reduced it by 50%, but still. That's gonna suck. <laughs> That's gonna suck. I don't quite. Why haven't you made a custom Tretch model yet? Uh, I was thinking of doing another modding stream as well. Uh, that one went down really well last time. I had a fucking blast doing it. The only problem is, like, people really wanted me to make them into full mods, and it took a long fucking time to get the Chad Stoughton one uh, working. Uh, and then that video did, like, super bad, but mostly, like, <laughs> it, um... It was like, I, like, I had to get so many people involved to get that work, and you guys don't even understand that. Like, that was a pain in the ass to get the textures working for that mod. And it was, and it was for such a stupid mod. You know, it was like a serious endeavor at all. Teeth Breakers, Eshin Triads. Oh, I'm so tempted to take a single unit of Teeth Breakers. I know we're not gonna have buffs for them. No, well, you know what? I'm, I'm staying true to the Stormworm and Doomstack. We'll sit in the pocket. We're good for that. All right. Uh, fully upgraded Stormworm guy. Stormworm in there. I'll worry about upgrading them into the. Uh, I'll worry about getting Whip Smart once they're at rank nine. But we need an ambush chance chance right now. The plus, dude. Oh my god. If we get, where is he? Oh fuck. Hold on. 
it's just occurring to me that the amount of melee attack that we'll get if we manage to make it succeed is going to be huge too or is it so if we get an ambush off with our ridiculous ambush chance we're getting an extra 13 melee attack for the entire army right and i don't think do these st wait a second do these stack no because you can't do an ambush and then also do something when retreating but 13 melee attack on top of all these other buffs oh Man, this is going to be a fun, fun army when it's completed. Can I peace out with him? Did I already trade agreement? 4,000. It's going down. He's going down. He kind of likes us. He kind of likes us. Honestly, at Okoy, with all of your SV getting encouraged, you could potentially uh, wear Grimgore down by the death blob. You know what? I need to cast her, like, fucking now. I need that Eshin. Okay, we're five more turns, and then I can build the... Uh, Den of Secrets, and that'll also allow me to get some more assassins from my other army, but mostly I can get that Eshin Sorcerer. And the faster I get him leveled up to get Black Whirlwind, the better, because Black Whirlwind is going to be amazing for chewing through, like, big blobs of infantry and shit. I, I feel like that's the, the thing that turns the tides. If you have a leveled up mage, they, that will save fights. Adokoi, can't you ambush, retreat, and try to ambush again? Yes, and also if I get attacked and then I retreat and they still get me in a fight, I still get plus 13 melee attack. So I just need to be careful not to run around in march stance and I'm good. We're good. Clan Gridus. Oh man. Am I ever going to get a faction that actually has like a legendary lord? Fuck! Not disgrace my ancestors. Oh you stupid. Gilbert Helheim, you little bitch. Are they not at war with um... You Wait, is he dead? Lord of the in such a Wait a minute, there's go- Okay, I think the reason that uh, the High Elves didn't- Should I- Okay, should I get rid of the Fog of Water check and see if he's dead? What do you guys think? What? I'm, I'm oh. really curious to know what happened to my guys. What happened to the High Elves? I want to know what ha I want to know what happened to Imric down here, because usually he attacks you. I want to know what happened to him, right? Should we check? No, he's still there. He's literally- He's totally here. He just hasn't moved. Guardian of the Phoenix Crown. Imric and Invmir. He's he just hasn't bothered. He's just here and he's ignored the dwarves completely. He hasn't even taken Bone Gulch. That the council's voice. All right. Fair enough. I don't know. I made Tretch. I made a Tretch monkey. What file type should I expo export it as? Okay. Here's the thing. Did you? If you. <laughs> um. I don't know what you mean. It's a complicated question because I don't know what what you mean an acid editor. What did you use for it? That's the thing. It's there's a lot of important feature, uh, factors. Okay, hold on. We footed perceptive. Okay, I'm gonna recruit a general in here. Oh, you bitch. Okay, we're gonna lose Darkhold. Warlock master. But I'm gonna put up a good fight. I'm gonna put up a damn good fight. Like, we gotta get rid of these ogres now! I don't go. Who's storm vermin better? Treach or Queek? Um... Tre uh, uh, almost unequivocally, it's probably gonna be... Tretch now. But... Um... Queek has minus 50% upkeep cost. So you could, you could make the argument that it's a better army just based on that. Because there's other armies that you can get with... Tretch that benefit more from Devastating Flanker than this army. Like... Wolf Rats, for example. Or, I guess, uh, Doom Wheels? Because they all get, you know, double charge bonus. Yeah, I don't know. Bit of a mixed one. I do not want to auto this. This is not a good auto. Fuck it. We haven't done a fight in a while. Let's check out it and see how good these uh, Storm Vermin are now. 50 melee attack, 42 melee defense. Wait, what? Wait, what the fuck? Why did our weapon strength go down so much? Oh, uh, wait, do we have the bloody thing on? Is that what happened? There's only it's only 36 now. That seems really low compared to what it was at. Maybe it doesn't show the buffs, like whatever. I don't call it. If you confederate Queek, you can recruit Storm Vermin in turn one faction wide. Highly recommend it. Dude, that's such a good. If he dies and we absorb him into our faction, and I recruit him in my main town, I can get. Oh my god, that's gonna be so crazy. With the Storm Vermin buffs, that's gonna be so good. 
You ambushed that first ogre army, remember? Had the buff for a few turns. Oh, it lasts a few turns? Oh, right, yeah, because we attack. Okay, 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 okay. I see. Because we get that um, diplomacy thing, right? I'm gonna do what I usually do and attack from this side. Minimal towers this way. Just all ass rush. What? What orders? You get a lot of dudes. I mean, if nothing else, Storm Urban have 160 per unit, so we got a lot of boys. Man, I love their weapons. All right, it's rat time. <laughs> Twitchy whiskers, you know what that means. Uh, maybe it's worth flanking? I'm good, actually. Man, I hope we get to confederate quick, actually. That would be so good. Minus 50% upkeep with all the buffs that we get for this faction. Come on, Sneeko. Push, push, push. What's our actual speed? 42. So, 42 isn't bad. I mean, unfortunately, we got that strength and numbers bullshit. Minus 10% speed, but the melee defense is worth it. It's so totally worth it. Adoko, I sent you the Tretch Monkey over Discord. It's just, like... What did you... Okay, but like... Oh! <laughs> I thought you were like a mod. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm so stupid. Dude, I thought you... <laughs> okay. I thought that you made a... Um... <laughs> I thought you made him into a monkey. I thought you turned Tretch into a monkey with mod tools. <laughs> Thank you, my dude. Hold on. Nice. We got a Tretch Monkey. <laughs> Thank you, my dude. He's got the back scratcher. Thank you. Much appreciated. That's going in the folder for sure. Thank you. Um, fuck, where's your name in chat? The door. Thank you, the door. Yes, yes. <laughs> the back sketcher is adorable. Come on, boys. Come on, shoot through them. They really should not be giving us even this much trouble. It's all this mass. Look at the girth we have to cut through. Oh, it feels so wrong to be attacking these beautiful boys. Three big guys. Oh, four big guys. Ready to roll Order them, not me. This is gonna be a slog, I can already tell. Push, 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 push. Wait, what's getting attacked? What the fuck? Why? What? Oh my god. Fucking CA and their fucking pathing, I swear to god. Son of a bitch. Alright, suicide some clan rats into them. Unbelievable. Da -na 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 -na. Go, 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 go. What kind of wall save are we running? 15% wall save on Tretch with... I want to say his 40% uh, damage resistance when losing melee combat. For him or for everyone? Affects allies in range max one. Wow. And 25% speed. Physical resistance 25%. Missile resistance 25%. Tretch based? Base Tretch?
He's kind of unironically getting genuinely pretty good now. It's hard to believe. Oh, chew through him. Man, this is taking a while. The ochres are too thick, man. And I'm going to be getting shot up by this fucking tower the whole time. Getting through this wall of girth is the problem. I don't think we can actually attack too because of the, uh, the sheer volume of dudes here. It looks like it's just kind of a stalemate. But the, we're, we're taking hits. Am I even damaging them? What's happening? This is rough. Man, what do even? Maybe I can like bait him out. I wouldn't. You can't even use spells on the ogres. Even if I have a caster, it wouldn't help. We have to get rid of this immovable wall of girth. Go! They're slowly chewing through us too. The ogres may win this based on girth alone. Come on, go, go, go. Alright, we just gotta push, try and break through a little bit. <laughs> they literally can't push through. Like, it's, they're incapable of getting through this girth. Oh my god, kill that bone crusher. 18 kills, my ass. Get him! Get him! There's simply too many rats. I think that's the problem. Man, you can see how little I actually fight ogres. Yeah, they're they're bail they're not even swinging. You gotta hit stuff, man. Come on. This is impossible. I should have just autoed. The wall of girth is just too much. They just keep piling in. Give me a break. On my last break. Hope you've finally accepted your love for Bongo and have gone through your stage. Oh my god. That's the Bongo shit again. of Rat and Poker. Let's take for the donut, Brandon. Okay, is this Rhett Orgy Simulator? This is Ogre... Fucking... Girth, girth Simulator, I guess. This is, like, real rough. Like, actually, diff like, hard to get through. It's not even that there's a, that there's a lot of them, it's just... Like there's there's like no attack animations. They're they're able to hit because they're monstrous, but we can't hit them. Uh maybe if we pull some units back. Guide us, horned one. Just split up the stack just a smidge. I don't even know what else to do. In the herd a little bit, I guess. So we can actually swing. <laughs> Damn. Hold back. There's too many of us. <laughs> There's too many of us, not too many of them. Possibly the weirdest retreat of all time. Get him! Ready, ready! Get 
I think we're finally hitting them a little bit. Maybe. I don't even know. <laughs> oh, too much girth. All right, lesson learned. I don't even want to flank around because they got like towers and shit. Forty kills, twenty kills, sixty, sixty kills. Oh wait, because it's Noblars, right? Now see, there's so many of them stuck in combat too. <laughs> God damn it. <laughs> I just fast forward, I guess, take the hit. At what point do you back out and just do a, an auto resolve? God damn. Or a, a, a Comet of Cassandora. That would be actually. See, this is what I mean. Maybe if I had a couple of spells. Spells are not great against ogres, though. You know, because they're, they're uh, low entity counts. Yeah, we're, we're still not chewing through them much. How much damage have they got? 2,000 per, roughly? 1,000? Man. Get in there. Smack his shit up. <laughs> oh. What a weird fucking fight. Yeah, we're losing a lot of dudes, though. Just based on the amounts that we started with. All right, we're slowly chewing through them now. But this is way closer than it ever should have been. I just noticed your one unit of Boga. Omega lol. <laughs> My ogre kill unit. And okay, imagine having an Ikit nuke here. That would do the trick. You'd be surprised how little damage it does to, uh, to anything that is an infantry, though. It's not weak, it'll do damage, but... Against monstrous infantry, it's significantly less strong than it would be, you know, pretty much any other unit type. Cavalry, it fucks up. Infantry, it fucks up. Monstrous and single entities, not as great. Monstrous infantry, actually, maybe it will be enough. God damn, I don't think I deserve these casualties. <laughs> this is some bullshit. Fuck it, go in, go in, go in. All right, can I get my fucking... There's too much now. There's way too much thickness for the fucking Doom Wheel to get through. Oh, they're coming back! Fuck off! Ah! Go, go, push, push. Break him, break him, break him, break him, break him. Go, go, go. Fucking push. Ah! Kill him! Ah, come on! Come on! Finally! Fuck! Oh my god! Decisive! <laughs> what? Holy shit. That fucking... That was so slow. It wasn't even hard. It just took fucking ages. If you think that is bad, imagine doing this as Nurgle with zero anti units. Yes, dude. I remember my, the Nurgle fights, especially the early ones in his campaign in the uh, Realm of Chaos, where you have to fight the ogres. So fucking boring. <laughs> especially because if you auto, the game fucks just completely trashes you like every other auto resolve. Luke Steel. All right, so here's the plan. Sentinels, Black Fortress, we go across, we take back Darkhold, presumably after we lose it, 
we go around we kill the dwarves we go down here we kill the we kill bug eyes and then we we own the whole south and then that's that's only three directions we can get attacked from that is like one of the best feelings in total war when you when you push people all the way to the border of a map and you know that you're not going to get attacked from that that perspective anymore so it's like putting your back against the wall or covering your flank completely so satisfying Lightning Strike would be good. Regen could be good. I don't want no bust for, for Icket right now. I mean... Ooh. Yeah. Ooh, we're at triple silver rank, though. The boy is getting stronger. Oh my god. Wait, it's the Red Anthem. Hold on, I gotta turn it up. This could not be a more appropriate song. Also, I just realized how useful Paranoid Defender would have been just for breaking up those blobs. So I'm definitely going to take that. Yeah, the rats. Warlock, master of scry. Of the deep CA, what anti large? Right? I, it really feels like I'm, I think I feel like seventeen anti large is a good amount, but right there it felt like it was doing nothing. I think it's because there's issues with the animations in this game that nobody really talks about enough. It's the same reason I don't like Kev because the way that their animations work and the way that their mass works, they they don't feel that effective. They're good strategically from for like getting around into archers and stuff, but you can do the same thing with flying units or fast infantry. Or monstrous infantry. Defensive lines. Fuck that. You're gonna drag me into all kinds of shit. No! Ah. Uh, okay, well, we gotta play it, right? We got six spawns of clan rats. We got some uh, teeth breakers. They don't have any fucking artillery. I have a good feeling we can... We can, uh... Hunker down in a pit or two. Give me some stress, boys. It's a settlement battle, so we actually have a full settlement. We have a lot of uh, defensive supplies. This is a really, really, this is a pretty solid map for this too. And I actually have an idea. Ooh, look at the lighting. Wow, that is fucking creepy. So the lighting mod makes it more intense. So it's darker and the green lights are more pronounced than shit. I think with my mods on, with like my visual mods on, this looks pretty fucking pretty good. Very scaveny, as you would expect. So what I'm thinking is we do, well, I do what I've always done in this map, which is camp way back here. We can always do a, reach, a retry yeah, if shit goes bad, but here's the thing. The AI do, will usually ignore barricade areas like this, and they will go for areas that are open. So if I put uh, leadership base missile damage, what the fuck? That's useless for Skaven. Yeah, some, if then I put some debuff shit down here, they're more likely to come over to the, these spots. I'll set my setup here. Yes, yes. Get ranged ready. Although yeah, none of these guys are armor piercing, so they're kind of fucking useless. And then... Build some strong towers. Hmm. Maybe a little too dark IMO? Yeah. Hold on. That made no difference. Wow, that makes... Wow, that... 200%... No! No, no, no! No! Don't apply changes. Fuck. Oh. Motherfucker. 
Wow, that's 200% brightness. What? What? That's the fucking same. There's no way that's actually doing anything, surely. I'm gonna leave it like 150. That's a little better, I guess. All right. We have warp lightning, so I can't forget about that. This, these ways are hopefully blocked up, but I'll leave a couple of guys there. Storm vermin up front. And then just like a whole mess of dudes behind. Rattling guns ready to mow down. Um, rattling guns are going to be just a, a must for this. Scaven slaves to waste their time. I'm telling you, it'll work. Oh, I forgot to turn the music down too. This is so loud. Oh, these can create du duplicates. What difficulty is this on? Uh, no, uh, very hard campaign difficulty, normal battle difficulty is what we're on. All right, let's see how this goes. We just need to earn enough. Put down these uh, debuff things. Things. Wait, no, I need a barricade here. I remember. So we kind of bait them into this, into our realm. Wait, can I put weapon teams on here? No, that sucks. But I'm going to use them. <laughs> My god, what is this placement? Oh, that'll be so good. Spearman ready. Teeth breakers down. So, hopefully, they will ignore these sections. I know this sounds stupid, but they leave the platforms alone from my experience, I'm telling you, this could work. How does it get? How does this look from the uh, stream perspective? By the way, can you actually see? Let me check. Ooh, it ain't great. Always looks darker on the streams than it does in your own game. Get fucked! Woo! This is why I recruit the Teeth Breakers. That armor piercing is- Oh, they have blasting charges. Yes! Get fucked. Oh, so good. So good. Now we just need to save up and build a tower. I want to say that it's worth it to build the highest level one, right? Nice. One down. Oh, shit, shit. We're getting shot. I cannot lose these guys to two quarrelers. Not, a, not an option. Not even remotely an option. They're down a unit of, uh, black- No! <laughs> you dicks! Oh, we got a warp bomb? Wow, okay. Oh my god, if- Okay, if they blob up, a warp bomb could be game-changing. One, one well-placed 100% armor-piercing 45 damage warp bomb to a unit right in the middle of thick-ass combat? That could change this whole fight. Okay, the plan's not working so far. They're just coming straight for us. It's fine, though. The point is they don't do that much damage. Okay, 2k, 660, 500. Yeah, it's worth it. Fuck it. Get him, get him, get him, get him, get him, get him, get him. I'm pretty sure Quarrelers will beat Clan Rats in a fight, but fuck it. So, you see how they're all kind of beelining over here to the right-hand side? I, I think that means that they'll leave this left side alone where the barricades are. That's for, from my experience, they, they actually tend to do that. Oh man, our, our supply chain is just so bad now though. Nice, nice. Can you do wall palm on summon units? Nope. Ah, that sucks. Night runners! Love playing Total War on HDD while I load out of battle. I get to watch you play for a couple of turns. Dude, yeah, the, I love watching streams when I'm playing Warhammer. Like, 
Oh, I, I always have something planned on my second monitor. Like, if you don't have a second monitor, get a second monitor. It's life-changing. You think, like, that sounds, sounds like a no-brainer, but a lot of people don't. Like, they just don't have a second monitor. They just never bother. Even if it's, like, a shitty Toshiba laptop from the year 19-fucking-12. I, I know that makes no sense. I'm exaggerating, but... Like, it's, it's, it's worth it. It's absolutely worth it. You can warp down su uh, bomb summons, but it has to have 50% uh, health. Oh, really? Hit points less than 50%. Yeah, you're right, you're right, you're right. Fucking archers. All right, shit, they're going down the right. Oh, we got 2k, we got 2k. Towers, my lord. All right, that'll be helpful. Kill him, kill him, kill him, kill him. Their archers are going to be the most dangerous thing here, to be honest. My 600 pound monitor from 1991. <laughs> the first monitor ever. We obey. Yes, yes. We are. What, what? Fire, 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 shoot, 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 shoot. Yes. Nice. Oh, that's so good, dude. I love rattling guns. Oh, let's go. Let's fucking go. No, don't let him get it. Don't go. Yes, 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 shoot. Keep shooting. Keep shooting. No. Oh, so close, so close, so close. Go, 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 go. Go, 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 go. Why are you going in a column formation? Just fucking run. Oh, he's so close to death. That's so annoying. Yeah, satisfying. Oh shit, they went around the right. I forgot about that. Shit, is there a tower build yet? No. Uh. All right, we got some some skirmish troops around the side. Ooh, that is not good for us. Alright, they're getting chunked up by the snowworm in a little bit. We got a wall lightning out anywhere. And they really- so they're ignoring this like I said they would. But... Ooh! Good shit. Less than 50% health on a unit. No. Ooh, what is- what kind of tower is that? Okay, I'm just gonna save up by another one. Alright, we're getting chunked up a little bit here, but we're wasting their time. Super important. It will, if we'll probably break before I have an opportunity to use the. Uh, hmm. I feel like they've got. Oh fuck! They have a whole another army. It's fuck. That is just team killing. Shit, I gotta commit way more over to this side. No! No. Okay, this unit of Skaven Slaves is below 50% health, right? So I, I have the ability to... Nice, 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 nice. I can use that here. Let's just angle these guys. Oh my god. Yes, yes. Now, ready, now. Scream, Ricardo, crack. Ooh. Are they armor piercing? I didn't actually check. Oh, wait, she did, they just, oh, fuck, they just grabbed my barricade. Oh, fuck. Not great. Not great at all. Rattling gun. But. Glamrat Spears. Rattling gun. We move, move. All right. Nice. Okay, now we just gotta weasel this 50% health unit in there. I think it's where the flag is. Get run. Run, 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 run. This way, this way, this way. Here. Really get in there. Really get in there. Really get in there. Come on. Come on, be good, be good. Yeah, boy! <laughs> nice! For the famine tide! For the Hell yeah! Tide. Get to runners! 
Okay, skirmish mode. Got a couple units, melee guys around here. Hold them like here. Oh, I love big explosions and big blow. Ah, no! 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 Not good. Not good. Not good. Okay, melee in. Melee in. Melee in. Woo! That was close. Also, I should get these melee in because I don't want to lose my fucking guys for no reason. Get out, get out, get out, get out, get out. Nice, nice. Okay, we're going okay. Rattling gun. I just gotta get these gunners a out. Rake. Even if we don't win, we're gonna do a lot of casualties to them, which is Clan what rats. I kind of mostly want anyway. Your, your desire. Yes, going. Can I just waste their time? Also, with these. No. Good, good master. Like here. Yes, in triads. Warlock master! Hey, what? It's then leap. What? Die, die, die! Okay, we can hold this now. Okay, they, you're hitting the wrong shit now, though. Hit the blobs. Blob time. Right. E. Yeah. Uh, fifteen hundred. That's worth it. Slightly weaker version of the other explosive terror. They're completely ignoring the left flank still. Archers are continuing to be a problem, but that's fine. Where are my gunners? Rattling gun. Right. Good stuff. Warlock master! I'm gonna save some of my wins of magic for the reinforcements though. And okay, I love explosions. Famous last words before drama happen. <laughs> it's gonna be fine. Bringing doom. Rats never die. Advance retreat. We just re retreat and recycle. Right, sorry, yes. Can, yes, I, yes. can I position my... Ooh, that could be good. Tyson, hurry. Ready, ready. Move, move. Man, they're, they're, they're a crazy amount of lords. It's kind of a problem, though. Good damage, good damage. Are we gonna get more melee in? Oh man, just keep them back. Stuff. Think if they're in combat, that means that they, they can't get hit as easily. No line of sight? Actually, you know what? It's probably better I need to keep him out of range. Ooh! Don't mind if I do! Oh! So satisfying. See, I could have saved that bomb until now, though. Death, Warlock! Do you think that range units will just run out of ammo eventually? And, like, <laughs> with a relatively good time? I could hold that with a unit of Clan Rat Spears. Yes, Master! Scary! Get the runners! String the cattle crack! Oh, uh, hit that blob. Right here. Right here. Uh, is that all the reinforcements? The, the balance of power isn't terrible. I've seen, I've come back from worse balances of power. For damn sure. I'm gonna save him. How the fuck do we not have line of sight there? Come on. Come on. That's come on, please, that would be so satisfying. Please. Rattling gun. Yes, that's so cool. Oh, that's so cool. 
<laughs> yeah, this fight's fun, man. This is a good one. Alright, hit this block, hit this block, hit this block. That's huge, that's huge for us. Alright, really in the thick of that block there. No, you need to be in god mode. Damn, that was cool for like two seconds. Guide us, horned one. Now, ready, now. Alright, with the last one of their generals. Uh, which one of these is doing the best? 33 kills, 35 kills, 9 kills. Uh, hit these blobs, hit these blobs, take them out. Oh shit, oh shit, 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 shit. No, 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 no. Get the fuck out of here! Ready. Rattling gun. No! Stop shooting my fucking gunners! No! Yes, yes, I knew the yes. quarrelers were gonna be the issue, but god damn. No! <laughs> Are you serious? Three, three. No, they're so close! Yes, yes, wow, yes. that is such bullshit. On, on they have 70 armor! Oh. Yes, yes. What a bunch of bull... Ch ...s. Retreat, retreat. Go, go, master. Alright, one last one. Retreat. Okay, not terrible. Uh, please. I don't have any way of killing their generals, I think, is my, my main worry. Because they could probably do this with just a couple of runesmiths and shit, right? No, they're breaking the majority of the range. No. A blasting charges, fuck you! No! <laughs> this is gonna be real bad. This is gonna be real bad, because they can get them off really fast! No! You son of a bitch. No! 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 This was going so well! This is a Pyrrhic victory, though, at least. And break him, break him, break him, break him. Get in there, break him. Hold him off. Alright, hold up, hold the rattling guns in the center. With everything else. No, don't break, don't break, don't break, don't break, don't break. Come on, you got 16 health. They don't own the center yet, please. Rattling gun. All right, shoot die, him. Night runners. Clan rat spears. At what point does their leadership break? I mean, fuck. Back underground. Yes, 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 yes. Gun, 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 gun. Anyway. Right, good. No, 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 no. Ah. Go! Um quick, quick! What what orders? Shoot him, shoot him, shoot him! Get him! Get him! Take him down! No, come on! Okay, yes, yes! This is so close, but it's not really. Rattling gun! Clan rat spears! Scampering! Yes, hit him, hit him, hit him, hit him, hit him, hit him. That's huge, that's huge. Get get in there. Get a shot in there. Just hold him off. Nice, 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 nice. Yes, 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 yes. Yes! Clan rat spears! Have him waste his time. Night runners! How much armor? 126 armor, 310 fucking kills! For a fucking what? 16,000 damage, 310 kills? Fuck you, dwarves in general. Warlock Fuck, what are we getting master! beefed by? We're getting, we're getting butchered by some. Ah, two heroes. Alright, get out of there. Get out of there. Run, 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 run. Break out. You're way faster than them. Just run. Just run. Just run. Just run. It's just a kiting game. Quick, quick, go! Towers on. Break them. Horned rats will. We can just piss away their time. <laughs> We can just waste their time. 
And their ammo. Yes. No, their hero is in Lord's no. No, come on. No, feed shit. Yes, yes. Run after me. Oh, I'm a defenseless little rat. Oh, I'm so defenseless and, and killable. Come on. Come on. Yes. Come on. Come on. <laughs> Why is this working, sort of? No, 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 no. Ah, oh, fuck it. Wait, you're just gonna, you gotta, you gotta get in there now. Nobody can catch the speedy rat. <laughs> no, 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 no. Yes, 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 yes. Get the melee guys in. Yes. Come on. Uh. Yes, come on. Shoot some stuff. Are they on fire at will? Yes, good. No, 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 no. Break out, break out, break out, break out, break out. Come on. Come on, dude. Oh no. Why are they not shooting? Come on. There we go, there we go, there we go. It must have been like a bump in the hill. Come on! Come on! Yes! Come on. <laughs> Nobody can get the speedy rat! No one! Yes! Yes, dude! Oh my god. He's dying. The general's dying. Yes, dude! Yes! Wait, there's a unit of archers there? What? When they get there? I'm like out of everything. No, 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 don't die. Don't, don't get hit. Don't get hit. Yes, 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 yes. Yes! You're doing a good job. You're doing a great job. You're doing an amazing job. I gotta tell the tower to attack this guy. <laughs> Yes! Yes! Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Yes, 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 yes. Now attack these guys. No, 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 no. Leadership's waning with him down here. Ah! Uh. Okay, yeah, attack generals. Shit. Dude, if I win this, no fucking way if I can win this. This is gonna be the closest fight ever. Come on, come on, towers. This is all on the towers. No, 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 no. No, 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 no. Get out of combat! Get out of combat! Get out of combat! Uh, what are the towers doing? Oh my god. Okay, note to self, those fucking Skaven towers suck. Ah, oh, no, no, no. Okay. Uh, no, 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 no! 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 No, no! Get, get, get him, 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 get him. All right, come on, General, you can come back, you can come back, you can come back, you can come back. Come on. Yes, 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 yes! Uh, just waste their ammo. Just waste their ammo. We're so close. No. Uh. Ah, oh, come on! Come on! Get back in the box. <gasps> this dude, that Hellhine guy. 470 kills. You can seriously eat a whole bag of dicks. Okay, I just gotta get this guy to chase me. I just gotta get this guy to chase me. Yes! Yes, you stupid fucking idiot! Uh, this tower is just gonna actually hit some shit. No! No! Why? Why? That's bullshit. That's bullshit. That's fucking bullshit. Oh my god, okay, finally the fucking tower can hit. Oh, we're back, we're back, we're back, we're back, we're back. 
Dude, oh my god, I've never wanted to win a fight so bad in my fucking life. Come on! Come on, towers! I got some more units here as well. No, I gotta just keep him off him, right? Yeah, come on! Come on, you motherfucker! Come on, <laughs> you little bitch! Oh my god. Dude, these towers suck dick. These towers suck so much dick. Like, holy shit. No. They're so bad. It's one projectile. It does bad damage, has no splash aura. And no! 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 <laughs> no! You son of a bitch! 822. Fuck this game! Fuck this game! 500 kills! 25,000 damage! What planet are you on, CA? Fuck you! What is that? Eat my fucking balls! 401 kills! What the fuck? That was some fucking bullshit! I killed so many! 538 kills and 25,000 damage. Fuck. Oh my god. I am offended. Fucking Clan Helheim. Bunch of fucking Wazic bitches. Oh. I'm so upset. What a bunch of fucking bullshit. I lead from rear. I earned that victory, goddammit. We fought the odds. Ooh. Fuck yeah, bone breakers for the boys. Alright, that's good. Bone breakers for the boys is good. Because that'll that'll help break up the fights quite a lot. I forgot they got bone breaker mounts. Bone breakers are so cool, dude. Kinda wish they didn't have like just exclusively, you know, big gem hands. But they're still pretty cool. Speed, always good. Mickey Mouse! Ah, oh, what what a load of Chad, Ver Ch Chad Dwarf versus Virgin Okoy. I got so many kills! How could you say that to me? We fought the odds so hard. I, I pulled out every cheese out of the, the big Skaven book of cheese. What more do you want? Adokoi, I miss the time when minor settlement garrisons provided globe ears. Bruh. Yeah, me too, actually. <laughs> Everybody was just kind of got the short end of the stick in terms of units. Starting armies, fun units for your starting army, shit like that. Alright, lightning strike, always useful to have. All right, so we take Dark Fortress, we let him regen for a second, we go over and we fuck the cheeks off their stupid little dwarf asses. Ah. Oh. Okay, he's starting his own book of grudges against the dwarfs. You know what? Yeah, we're starting the great book of grudges. We're, we're starting the, the great... We're starting... The great notepad of grudges. The Great Skaven note, Notepad of Grudges. Number one. The Hell Hind Dwarves. Alright. 
What what is um what do we call it? Skaven book of grudges. I right, forgot what I called it. Grave skin is a great skin. <laughs> the great Skaven notepad. All right, Helheim dwarves. Remind me to cross that off. How many Crank or Jank fights does Okoye even sent to Legend? I mean. He could probably have won that fight, but he would have pulled out some some rancid cheese. I'm gonna take You know what we don't actually need money and I'm not about to go into the defensive alliance with this with the fucking Darklands orcs. Dude, we killed we took multiple of their cities and they fucking like us because they hate the Eyebiters more than they like us. They they hate the um Eyebiters more than they hate us to the point where they really like us a lot. <laughs> we oh, fucked yes, with them that much. Deal. Oh. Maybe I can get away with recruiting a couple of storm vermin. They're so expensive, actually. Some clan rats. All right, next. I don't know. I called it the rat with the rat book of angry. <laughs> I don't know. You fucked the resolution or something. We can't see the edges of the screen. Oh fuck! Wait, did I did I put the? Hold on. There you go. My bad, my bad, my bad, my bad, my bad, my bad. It's fixed. Oh. Why you contact me? But what you want me? Yeah, I zoomed it in to look at the uh, the notepad and I forgot to zoom it back out. Military access for... Okay, I'll take 600 free, free dollar dudes. When do you turn down money? You're never too rich to turn down free money. That's what <laughs> assholes always say. Uh... Fuck it. Right, let's kill these stupid little sissy dwarves. Call me Lord Craven Tail. Oh, I'm gonna Oh I'm gonna clap the cheeks off him so good. That is going in the feckin' book. <laughs> Thanks for the dono, Blue Dog. <laughs> That's good. That absolutely is going in the book book. Yes, yes. Maybe if we ambush dance him, right? Oh what? No, I want I want replenishment from my og ogres. Not much else we can do, really. Unless we can get some deals. I do kind of want to really kind of massively want to peace out with Grimgore. Because he's pe- Because- <laughs> the Oh, the greenskins are too strong now, man. I don't know what happened, but the greenskins have gone up in echelon back to how they were in Warhammer 2, and I don't like it. I got so tired of the green side, man. I wish that um, there would be a random modifier for each campaign where it gives extra strength, like a handicap, but like a, a negative handicap, but just specific factions. And it doesn't tell you, and the only way to find out about it is to just to see how well the, the factions do. Because I mentioned if you did a campaign, but Cathay owned all of Cathay and, and just wiped out all the other factions, started to push out of Cathay. So you had to start fighting Cathay. Or like the Beastmen started to. to, to like steamroll and actually do super good and the greenskins get killed super early and it's just like everything's backwards i want to see something like that i want to see like i want to see my expectations betrayed and just the whole game just be come like the end game turn out differently i'm definitely gonna be doing that with sfo i'm gonna buff all the factions that normally get fucked and then i'm gonna uh debuff all the factions that do super well like the greenskins the greenskins are gonna have like a 50 percent nerf when, when I do the SFO Ogres campaign. I want to see weaker factions do better, you know? Just for a change, man. Just to fight some new factions. I fight Greenskins, Greenskins so often. Uh, you know what? Clan rats. Oh, it's a Dwarf Genocide time. I think it might be Dwarf Genocide time. Oh, come on, ambush, 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 ambush! I've got like an 89,000% chance of an ambush. Get fucked! Oh, I'm gonna piss on your fucking grave! Uh, who is, uh... Is this the same guy? It is, right? Thorgod, hold fast. Oh! Yes! <laughs> Get fucked! Nice. Nice. Truly satisfying. A good feeling. Nothing like that sweet, sweet feeling of revenge. It's 
<laughs> what? Because uh, they're dwarves, maybe? Is that why my odds of winning this are just like super low? Oh. I guess it's a minor settlement battle. I wouldn't say this is a Pyrrhic victory, though. All right. Dwarf type, dude, if we hit turn 40, the dwarves are gonna get the dwarf type because I have on the ultimate end times mode. So the green skins and the dwarves are gonna just be ridiculous. Adokai just musked all over the dwarf. <laughs> Uh, look forward to Okoi getting clogged up in the choke points again. Oh boy, that's... I'm probably going to spread out and attack him at multiple sides, man. The thing is, if they're around... Uh, if they're around Tretch and they, they're winning a battle, they get... Uh, something, I think. Don't they? Don't they get a buff if they're winning? There you go. No, that's not it. Not scurry away. Don't, they, don't some of them get like a buff if they're winning in a fight near him or some bullshit? Hey, yo, I've never seen this map scavened out. Whoa. It's like a greenskin settlement, but it's all scavened up and scaven corrupted. Wow, that's cool. That's really cool. <laughs> scaven and dwarves fighting over a greenskin settlement. What a weird afternoon. Uh, where's the best place to attack him here? I'm just gonna fucking dive in head on. We're gonna be so much faster than them too. I never do this, but I'm just gonna pull an AI and just spread out. And that's how the big if it's in a one on one. Choking on the girth. Hopefully, it won't be another girth. It's like, I'm not gonna hit a wall of ogre flavored meat this time. I think I'm just gonna. I think we'll be fine. The skins again. The boys. Hey, I forgot they had the fucking bone crushers. Nice. Woo! <laughs> Fuck, I think that... <laughs> I think the Chieftains deserve more credit for being able to stay in this little box while they do shit like that, like body slams and shit. No one gives them enough credit, I think. Get the fuck out of the way! <laughs> I love that ability. So good. They're doomed. They're just so doomed. Adokoi, any progress on making Ogre Koi? Oh, shit. Yeah, I was gonna hand that off to a different modder and hopefully get some help with it, but... Yeah, no. I haven't uh, made any progress on it. It took so long to kind of, like, mod my way into... Um, into knowing kind of what I was doing a little bit, like just picking up the basics enough to put together that mod with a lot of help, like a lot of help. Like I had a lot of help putting that together from all sorts of talented modders. So like maybe if I can get some dudes to help me with it, push it through and stuff to just know what they're doing. Cause I can make the models. I, and I know how to work an asset editor to make the physical models, but like getting the textures right. Um, there's a lot involved in it, man. It's really hard. Forty-two speed with debuffs, nice. For the vermin tide, slay and stab. Yeah, it looks like uh, okay. So storm vermin have yeah, ten armor piercing weapon damage and thirty-three, twenty-two armor piercing weapon damage. So it's actually not what, as what? that big of a difference, really. I mean, it's over double, but. Guide us, old one. Slate, slate, and skitter. Is he finally good? Yeah, kinda, yeah, pretty much. I mean, he's significantly better than he was. 
but the thing is, you have to rate good by every other faction in the game, you know what I mean? He's not just good because he doesn't suck anymore. Um, he's like, reasonable now. I would say he's like, I give uh, Tretz like a good 7 out of 10 so far. Like 6, 7 out of 10 now. But he was a 1, so... I wish Stormbringer with great weapons existed. I mean, that's essentially what... A Halberd is a great weapon. You know? I don't... Do they actually exist in the lore? Is there a Stormbringer with great weapons in the lore? Like, are they a tabletop faction? A uh, unit of faction? Um, who is the new worst now then? Uh, it's they're not it's not new, but probably Greasus. Uh, legitimately vanilla Greasus and the way that the ogres currently function is probably the worst general in the game in terms of how strong he can be. Like you can make him passable, but on a whole, he's just pretty terrible. Like pretty unapologetically bad. Wow, they're taking really and I, you hate to say it, and I ha you hate to see it, and I hate to say it, because I love Grim, uh, the ogres and everything, but you can't just pretend that he's good. Nice. Easy. Easy dwarf uh, massacre. Oh god, yeah, Grizzus is awful. Like, if he had a- here's the thing. If he had a foot mo model, like, a foot lord model, like, you know, 50 something speed like a regular ogre bull or whatever or like a regular ogre lord like a regular generic ogre lord right a tyrant they uh he would automatically be way better and also if he had armor like just a little bit just like a smidge of armor maybe like 50 40 or 50 or some shit he's got rings on he's got some jewels but he, he doesn't even have a gut plate like i get it maybe he's a like but large Traditionally in this series, large lords. I'm just gonna occupy level three. Fuck it. Hey, nice. Call me Lord. Council God. Now we're talking. Uh, what do we replace? I want to replace the swordsman. Maybe actually. Uh, fuck it, spearman. Let's just slot one in. Who's got the lowest XP? Probably this guy. Could guess my All right. Tail. Yeah, if you gave Greasus a footlord model, like if he had the option of being stood up with decent speed or being sat down on his cart, but he gets way higher melee defense and like, I don't know, very good AOE buffs for troops around him. So he kind of becomes like a mobile kind of like buff lord, a support lord who can still fuck, fuck people up in melee, but just not as good as if he's on foot, right? Okay, I have seen in CAs known issues that they themselves consider uh, settlements too weak. New settlement garrisons feel weak. Yeah, Adokoi, Ogre mercenaries mechanic simply doesn't work because the war with every because uh, they war with everybody and you can, uh, always can't recruit them for all human factions. I mean, I don't have much trouble recruiting ogres. Like, for the most part, in my campaigns. There's always, like, but then again, I don't go out of my way to declare war on them and shit, so. And I also don't play human factions very often. So maybe I don't know. Yeah, I could think of some some pretty big reworks for the Ogre Kingdoms. I'm hoping I can weasel my way into CA's, uh, you know, back rooms to, to maybe like whisper some sweet nothings in their ear about how to improve the Ogres though. I'd love to have a hand in that, man. I played them so much. I would just, I'd love to be at the table for that. Like, I, I don't have any technical qualifications. I just really want to. <laughs> I just want to be at the table, man. Planarets. Fuck, what do we have extras of? Doom wheels, right? Yeah, doom wheels, fuck it. Doom wheels, maybe a little bit of artillery sp uh, sprinkled in. Ugh, I want the more speed. Huh. Maybe a Victor's Death Squad would be a good mix-in because they still. Uh, no, I, they're not as good as the unit of Stormbringer now. Also, really low armor too, and no missile resistance, which is up to twenty percent. Wait, what, what gives them that extra bit? Oh yeah, it's fifteen percent when we get Whip Smart, right? 
All right. Oh no. Really? Why are we so unhappy? Lack of scaven corruption, corruption. Oh, provincial instability, scaven corruption, uh, level of control, buildings. You see, I've been building a shit ton of task matters platforms. So I was like, eh? Fuck right, we're gonna have to send this guy over. So Tretch is good now? I would say so, yeah. General, generally, I think if you're comparing to, to how he used to be, which obviously, yeah, I think he's actually decent now. Give him a whirl. See what you think. I think he has a lot more options for Doomstacks too, just based on the fact that he now has like an army-wide buff of uh, devastating flanker. So anything with a lot of mobility that you're going to be flanking with a lot, you know, it suddenly became a lot better. And there's, you know, speed buffs for Storm Vermin and shit. 46 speed for Storm Vermin? Really good. I mean, I can't wait to do an ambush with this guy because we can wrap, completely wrap up an army in Storm Vermin. God damn, how long was that last battle? Clan Morgan. Ugh, fucking sca- Oh, hit and run. All right, I want to see what, what speed we're up to now. Also, where's the- Ah, Storm Vermin. Wow, that's, that's so far away. You serious? Movement range. Let the bell scream, scream. Oh no. Oh shit. Okay, he owns pig butter. Oh boy. We're definitely about to get attacked by, uh, by Imric from down south. I need to get a garrison built here, like, fucking now. Oh. Very buffed clan rats will be useful. What spell does it do these guys get? Pestilent breath, 0% armor piercing, 20 and a breath attack. Not... Not super good. Kind of bad. I cut. Oh my god! I can't even recruit clan rats. Okay, we can afford it. Nice. Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Uh. Here he is. Clan hide up. I'm still beelining for the dwarves, fuck it. Are there any, is there anybody we can ally with down here? Oh my god, definitely not this guy. Negative 100 aversion, I guess that makes sense. They do need like the rats. Clan Rictus has elite storm vermin called death vermin in the law. What? Death vermin. Why are they not in the game? Hey, what? Death vermin, also known as the under empire... Uh, in the throughout the Under Empire, as the Black Death are the elite of Clan Rictus, formidable storm vermin regiments. Perhaps the most proficient warriors of all Skavendom. The Death Vermin are utterly, utter, utterly ruthless and have crushed their enemies in countless battles, much to the annoyance of the uh, of the clan's warlord Cratch Doomclaw. What? The Death Vermin pose a significant threat to the uh, to Lord Doomclaw's own power base, and despite throwing them into hopeless battles on numerous occasions, they have returned victorious every time. Why not make them into a unit? That would be fucking bitchin'. Imagine, like, a new, like, tier 5 um, Storm Vermin variant, like, that you can recruit from, I don't know, something. Uh, put, make them a, a, a Clan Rictus specialty that you recruit from the Clan Rictus Great Hall. You could even like cap them or some shit. Make them get all of the uh, storm vermin buffs, or, or have a, a Rictus Clan Hall level two building that you get at tier five, and then there, you get death vermin, and they're like super strong. My SFO has them. Ooh, seems like a no-brainer. Like you just gotta make a really cool reskin, great weapon wielding variant of death of a storm vermin, and bam, you got a fully unique bitchin' endgame unit. Radius mod added them in, I believe. It radius or SFO? Radius is different, right? Like I said, I haven't played SFO in a while. Yeah, I'll do. Uh, I'll, I'll totally jump on uh, ogres in SFO because I, I like to see if um, Grimgor has been uh, Greasus has been improved. I don't think we can tweak all the factions and shit. We get. We'll have everybody like vote. Like, what factions do we buff? What factions do we make stronger? We'll just like customize the game how we want it. East Treaty. Fuck you. Really? 
don't know why that took me so long to process how stupid of a, <laughs> of a question that was. Hell no. Demon caller. Uh, how's everybody doing? Uh, bloody hands are still dangerous. Uh, Greasus is slowly moving south, just completely occupying all of the Greasus's territory. That's um really worrying for many reasons. Clan Rick. Na 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 na. This way, way. I don't go it. Uh, no, an SFO Rick just stomp over me, no death from it. Oh, okay. That's fine. We'll see an SFO though. Uh, what well, what people have an SFO? I'm serious. Like, I, I apparently Greasus hasn't really been touched much, so maybe we'll end up going Scrag. But I'm pretty sure Scrag got even less of a treatment. And Greasus, uh, Scrag needs um, you know, a patch way less than than Greasus. Greasus is in dire need of some rebalancing. Call me Lord Real dire need. Uh, how much else? Dude, we're only. Th oh my God, we're we're, we're uh, we're seven in it. We're, yeah, we're seven turns away from uh. Hell on Earth. An opportunity, yes, yes. Shall we make the promise out? My loyal, trust me. What? Oh. oh, come on! I do. That's something that I've noticed a lot happening recently is uh, the AI and trade agreements a lot like like they they just end them constantly I'll get help. Nah, whoops, I think it, it obviously it's just based on when the when the faction doesn't have super great diplomatic relations with you so it makes sense but still Mighty am I wait did I just see uh, fuck Maybe I can uh, curry some favor with the Blue Roses. Ghost would be a valuable ally. What? Yes. Clan Verum. See, I shouldn't have fucking. Oh god, I regret allying with Clan Verum so much. They've, they're fucking me with this. Stronger dwarfs, dude. Fuck that. I'm just gonna take the auto. We have the um. We have the uh, replenishment to do to be able to do that now. I think. Fuck yeah. Seventeen percent. Now it's like twenty-four percent. Oh, our first gold rank. Oh man. Okay, we definitely need to uh, get that thing now. And, uh, I really need to level out the audio. It's really irritating that some tracks are just so much louder than others. You think stinky elf guy will come back to defend his shit in the south? Oh, they're still going. Blue Rose is supplier of the finest aged meat food. I mean... I don't think Vampire Counts can have anything. Are they like evil? In the lore, the Vampire Counts? Because I know that it's, it's just basically... Powerful mages. Powerful vampires that just like raise up a bunch of dead shit and that's their homies is just them raising up legions of dead stuff no just very old oh but that's everything in the wama universe are the, the lizard men are they evil no they're just super old and aggressive i don't think there's any good guys in the warhammer world though because they've all committed like mass genocide on every race 
Except the ogres. The ogres are just good boys. They, they're just desperately hungry and they can't help it. Free my boys. They're innocent. Ogre eats just for fun. I mean, no, they eat because they're cursed with eternal hunger. They don't eat for fun. They probably eat <laughs> ogre apologists. <laughs> There's nothing to apologize for, dude. Can't apologize if they've done nothing wrong. Don't know what you're talking about. Free my boys. Ogres find everybody good with the side of <laughs> for the side of fries. <laughs> True. Any truers in chat? Oh fuck. Oh nice, we could just Extra food. Hey, it's the big boy. Come on, Grizzus. You got this. Kill Grimgore. Beat him back. Beat him off. Uh ooh. Oh, yeah, actually, yeah. Look safe. Everyone is food. That sounds like something Skaven would say, too, though. In the defense of ogres. Hell yeah! Clan Hellheim destroyed. Also. I'm gonna leave the red ogres for now, but I'm gonna get me some snipers. Hey! Whoa! Oh, they do not like us. What the hell? Negative 49 to a non-aggression pact? Negative 10 aversion. They're Skaven! Why do I have aversion against Skaven? Because Skaven don't trust Skaven? Is that the justification for that? What a bunch of bullshit. <laughs> Adequate. Greases for Grimgor is not going to end like you want it to. Uh, you count the end times. Yeah, I know. Grimgor uh, put the slap, uh, the smackdown on the Grease Man. Killed him and enslaved the ogres. That being said, um, like, in fairness though, Grimgor did that to everybody. It wasn't just the ogres. He fucked up everybody. You wanna, you wanna check in and tell me how the Chaos Dwarves did against Greases or? The hobgoblins, or I don't know anybody else for that matter. That dude just bopped around everywhere, just like crumping shit left and right. He's just absurd in the lore. Nice. What actual buffs do they get? Missile resistance, right? Thirty-five percent missile resistance. Damn right. 35% and then shielded, and then they get more melee attack and leadership. Oh yeah, 56 melee attack. Chieftain of the Deep Warrens. All right, Adoko, how bold are you? <laughs> what a weird question. Then that guy. No, I'm kidding. I have like super long hair, my guy. Lord Chosen. Adoko, Skaven hate everyone, especially other Skaven. Yes, yes. I uh, disagree. I think they maybe hate. Wow, that's a really good army. Holy shit. Let oh my god! Scream, scream. Tier 5, a full tier 5 setup with a stacked garrison. Wow. Poison Wind, Mortars, Storm Vermin, Gutter Runners with Poison, Mutant Rat Ogres, and a Hell Pit Abomination. Wow. That's pretty crazy. I don't call hair reveal. I'll eventually do like maybe a face reveal kind of thing. It's more likely to happen once I get a cat cam, because then I'll have a webcam. 
a stream cam anyway. It's not a huge priority for me though, man. Like, I, I'm not super against it. I just don't... I feel like content doesn't need you to be have me in the corner, you know? I know a lot of people prefer it though, so... I like watching people when they have a webcam on. Like, you know, Jerma and stuff. Like, like Kraken or whatever. All right, I think it's time to declare war on the on cats and bug eyes. Nuran, they're definitely gonna attack me here. If I, mm, maybe I should push pause and build a garrison first before I uh, attack them. Oh wait, can I get everything back? Ah, uh, one more turn. Close to the mage. Medical, I thought it was you in the corner. Slash, <laughs> that is, I mean, I look a lot like that, but with like just longer hair. Adokoi, I get you. You can see the visual jokes over the verbal humor. It adds sometimes. Yeah. Yeah, it does. I play in the dark though, man. And if you're, if you're streaming, you got to play with the lights on. Or like, I'm going to, oh fuck, I'm going to buy like a light source and shit. Oh man. I sit in the dark like a little gremlin man when I play video games. You know? When are we gonna see monkey feet? Hold on. I'm a man of the people. There you go. That counts, right? Sheesh. Mercy, it's getting hot in here. I'm a channel, fuck it. Wait, why am I channeling? I don't have a mage. God damn. Chitter Skull constantly winning undead factions who want to rush into gashes are constantly seething. Dude, actually, um, it would be kind of cool to, to redo that campaign where I played as a uh, vampire faction, but I started in the gashes are. I think that'd be, that'd be pretty fun. So like, play as um, I don't know, somebody that benefits greatly from from like, you know, Nagash style buildings that start in Nagash's are, and just work my way out. Maybe like fight, fight over here. See how it goes. It seems like a really good base to start in, like a super good defensive base. All right, time to declare war on this wiener. Eat my balls! You stinky little elf. Oh, Imbrick's like right there. Oof, I kind of don't want to auto now. But they do have a sun dragon. Uh... Fuck it. I can't auto like that. Adokoi, how do you feel about Vampire Coast? I played Vampire Coast again recently. I actually like Vampire Coast. I like Vampire Coast way more than I like Vampire Counts. Um, they're a way more flexible faction. They get more interesting units, in my opinion. For me, like, units that I like more. Uh, Vampire Counts uh, to... I, I got kind of a sour taste in my mouth about them when they kind of just were very OP. They just became super OP uh, for the way they were balanced in multiplayer and shit. Um... And I just, I, I don't know. I've never been a huge fan of them. I, I could play them more though. Like it's been a long time since I played Vampire Counts and I mean a long time. The last time I played them was Ghost to do the uh, 20 Zombies Doomstack, uh, 19 Zombies Doomstack. And the, the time I played them before that was like 2018 or like whenever I streamed them or did the something for a, for like a game. I like never play them ever. I only play them to make videos occasionally. Master Necromancers only is super fun. I mean, Necromancer stands as one of the strongest team stacks I think I've made. Wait, all my shit has Vanguard deployment. What the fuck? Why does all my shit have Vanguard deployment? Oh, because I just declared war on them? Oh yeah, I get all the army buffs because of that. I forgot. 
I'm gonna do the sneaky. Wait. I think my ogres are too fat to hide. Now we're good. No, but the doom wheel is. So I'm gonna distract them with the doom wheel like a big dingus. And we're gonna do the, the classic rope and dope. What? Oh, fuck off. God damn it. <laughs> One of them is out of the trees. Fuck. Offensive bonus from war declaration. Yeah, 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 yeah. I realized. I realized. That's pretty cool. They were in the trees, man. They're just holding twigs in front of them, pretending to hide. That sounds like the dude. That was so funny. The, the uh, when CA were did that video about the ogres and that Scrag did an ambush, and they had that clip of him just standing behind a thin tree. <laughs> uh, all right. <laughs> That noise. Wait, what was that? Is it the song for What was that? Was that trash? I <laughs> Double check concealment. Oh, dude, wait. I can. Oh, okay. Perfect. Perfect. That's a good. I can use um, stay here. I'll get help to uh, wait. Self ally leadership. Ah, oh, never mind. It, it's only for him. Ah oh, man, that makes that so much worse. What the fuck? What? What? What the fuck? Why? What the fuck it What I don't understand. I don't understand what's happening. Is it just that unit specifically? Why does it keep happening? There has movement? Paid actor What <laughs> what's happening? I don't know why why are they not hiding in trees? It's like a specific spot? They might be too clumped up together and pushing each other. No! I've never had that issue before. Right. You're going in the thickest part of the fucking trees, you stupid fucks. For the famine tide. Right. Red. Fuck. Spearman, yes, right. Yes. Spearman is right. Look, hidden. 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 Everybody's hidden. Eyeball, eyeballs across the board. Ogres are in the mix. I'll, I'll separate them too. They're in, they're in columns. This has to work now, right? Their armors bang against each other makes noise. That's not true! You're lying to me! Alright. Finally! What the fuck? Jesus! What just happened? New addition to the book book. Oh shit, we're getting fucked. Oh no. Oh boy! Oh my god. Towers are no joke. This is why I don't like attack like fighting them. Ah! <laughs> Run! Nope. 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 Get out of here. There we go. We're lucky, helmet cat! Go, 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 go. Smash it. 46 speed ain't bad. Are they actually going 46? Uh, yeah, they look like they're going fast. Oh, ogres will go 59, and ogres are only going a little bit faster than them, so yeah, definitely. Doomed wheel? <laughs> rats, rats. It, units going into columns is also very annoying. <laughs> Is it cunning or pudding? 
Dude, look, look at their whole shit. They're just panicking. And all their towers are built on this side of the settlement and stuff. So good. Come on, break down, break down, break down, break down, break down. Go, 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 go. Break it down! Beware of the spells. Oh boy, yeah, I didn't think of that. Spells could really fuck us up here, and they do have an Auk, Auk Mage. Fuck, that took a long time. Ah, oh, they got some whole messes of Soeth. Damn, you never see people with with uh, salt messers. Man, they, they do kind of look cool. I've always loved their animations with them holding the salt to the side and shit. The fancy sword style. Yes, yes. I, I want to just watch him go flying. Do the giant scaven fart attack. <laughs> it doesn't even do damage, it just looked funny. Oh shit, they have a sun dragon. Oh fuck, they have a sun dragon. Oh shit, fuck, they have a fucking shit sun dragon. Fuck. Okay. Oh, okay, never mind. It's, it's jumping into melee. No, it's not. Yes, it is. No, it's not. No, it's not. It's not. Yes, it is. God damn, pick a lane. Don't need that. Alright. Debuff it? Nope, that's for generals only. Alright. Alright. Alright, push up. Wait, can, did they abandon the and they abandoned the walls? So we get the new wheel in, let's go! Oh god damn my boys are strong! Look at this dragon going to like a sack of shit! Oh boy! Body slam that bitch! <laughs> oh I love Brad Ogres so much. Get it! Look at it try and scuttle away with his little legs. Beat its ass, beat its ass! Body slam it! Let's go! Get through the gate, man. Come on. Fuck. This is the real problem with infantry armies, too. If this is a single entity doomstack, we'd already be, like, right up in the paint. But it ain't. Alright, dragon's dead. That's good for us. <laughs> Look at them trying to do magic on ogres. Ogres can't even spell magic. Just a stream of rats coming in. Break it down, break it down, break it down, break it down. Let's go, 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 go. Oh my god. Come on, pathing. Good old settlement, CA settlement pathing. Alright, we'll be destroyed soon. Oh, these archers are gonna get ogred on. Any second now. Our tile's yours. Quick, quick! Squeak, squeak! Yes. Wait, is this in combat? With what? Oh, a door. <laughs> go kill him, move, murder him! Go, 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 go! Oh, no, 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 no. Call the meat! Go, my luscious lads. Just kind of fall on them a little bit, and they'll all die. <laughs> Look, they're like, brace! <laughs> oh, okay, shit. I gotta take out that Archmage before they do some, uh, some of that magic bullshit. Yeah, that Arch Archmage has gotta die. If they cast one spell into this blob, into my big, beautiful Skaven blob. Also, the idea of two giant rats body slamming this woman I, is just too good of an opportunity to pass up. Yes, yes, yes! Get them! 
I wish the Elven buildings didn't appear so plastic looking. Uh, they probably don't... I mean, they don't look that bad. You know, they got some stone to them. I think it's just because they're so over the top and decorative that they look like... It's like the building versions of like those 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 plastic swords you see in a kid's bin. In like a kid's toy bin. You know, plastic kid's toys of swords? That's their, their whole vibe is like that, right? Hold on. I wanna check. Hang on. <laughs> like this. <laughs> like these are the vibes that I get from from uh fucking oh, the whole like high elves are like oh shit high elves are like this they're like this kind of shit right like big shiny plastic decorative fucking over the top bullshit <laughs> wait 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 literally right there right right there fucking high elf sword <laughs> hey, it's Tyrion. You know what I mean. It's that over the top, cheesy kind of like plastic sword thing. We have literally too many rats. They're just getting stuck. Like this. This is a problem that needs resolving. Right here. They just get stuck on corners and they don't path and they all start walking and like it's just so slow. Running plan scheme. Snicked the apprentice. <laughs> oh no, you don't. Plan chicken. <laughs> this poor woman. <laughs> oh Jesus, stretch. Them, get body slam, get body slam, get body Ah, <laughs> <laughs> oh, classic. Cuts out, boy! Doom wheel! At once, master! Chew <laughs> through him! Rip through him! Move, boys! Straight, straight! Bring us me! He's got to be doomed now, right? Stretch is actually exceedingly strong now. I don't even have a single buff for him, for him specifically. What? <laughs> what? <laughs> what? What the fuck? What? Eh? What? What the fuck just happened? I've never seen that before. Is she a fucking slon? Did she just get teleported? What the fuck was that? I have never seen that before. Them just despawn like that? <laughs> Skaven magic. Yeah, apparently he just like fucking did some anime move and teleported them into a different universe. Annihilate! Die, die, screaming! No, move, oh, move, move. Fear me. <laughs> God damn. Scum. I go. Killing time. Oh no. No, our ogres are completely surrounded. Fuck! Chose me, me. Move! Plan, Our resolve is failing. Far, far and no, fainting. my ogres! Me reposition. Get knocked over. Run, Run ogres! Away. Oh fuck! No! Yes, master. Scary. Run for it! Shriek! Destroy thing! Protect me! Was that trench? Just twitching. <laughs> Protect me. She got Thanos dusted. Yeah. My assassin snapped his little red fingers, and they just deleted. 
I noticed they kind of like fell onto a uh, like a nearby box, like a, like a decorative settlement, like I box in the settlement. So maybe it, maybe that's something to do with it. This way. Well, I'm gonna Go leave my ogres if I do that. Here but we're gonna pull back. Down. Pull back and defend, boys. What? 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 Oh, they got so much more shit. Slay no fires. Make corpse corpse. Kang kang kang. Slay stab. Go go go. At least they're not slow. If these if the slow room were still like, look how fast they are. Hell yeah. Ready, ready. Hide and hurry. Much scurry, yes. Go 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 go. Where's the cap point up here? That's not it. Wow. That's so much choke point. I think we can safely say that the, the Tretch is definitely good though, right? Yes, yes. I mean, this army alone. No, this is not exactly a good test for it, but. <laughs> it is the scape of the Man, White Lines of Strace have got to be the coolest looking infantry for, uh, for High Elves, right? Anybody else? Trace pilled? They're, they're, they're genuinely, like, they've got to be the coolest, right? Something about high elves with axes is just so unconventional and cool to me. Hold true. Storm the vermin. Axes are always extra cool. They're cooler than their like dorky elf swords. That's for sure. Doom wheel. The ball. No. Oh, oh just, retreat, just, retreat, just retreat. Just retreat. Just retreat. Winding it up. You have permission to withdraw. How are we not one yet? There we go. Sunfang is cool. I mean, eh, eh, it's okay. I mean, if you like big flamey, pla like fucking fantasy swords, cool. Like I guess. I'm like way more, I find that shit so boring because it's just all you see in fantasy games. I love it when a character has like a really fucking different or vicious looking weapon. You know, like a giant war mace or like flails or some whack shit. I like it, it's like, like lightning halberd, for example. You will regret this. Call me Lord Craven Tate. Hmm. Dual blood katanas like Warhammer? Exactly, Warhammers. Much cooler. I don't even know, like, what do you do when you, oh yeah, endless training, right. All right. I shoot everything at gold rank. So this is kind of like, I guess the pinnacle of Stormbrim and maybe one or two more points of weapon strength and armor. But you're getting to sort of like a 45 average, which is pretty insane. And then drastically less for the for the halberds, I guess, just from the base weapon damage. But also they do majority weapon strength, so technically better. But also they're not shielded, so there's like give and takes. 49 speed though, unbuffed. Like on on with the negative 10%. What's Emric got? That is beneath me. God, okay, so. I hope that's something that SFO changes as well with like caps and shit is so like 
he always has the same army. He has a Dragon Bridges and a Sun Dragon because he starts with it, and he's recruited, like, basic shit. And we're on turn 38. Like, if I'm able to get, you know, Storm Boom and stuff, even if you're playing on Legendary difficulty, all they ever get is, like, spam banners of generic units. Like, I want to see the AI adopt some different strats and recruit some different shit. Not that I want to fight, like, something crazy strong every time, but... I'd rather fight something strong and challenging and interesting. Something strong and interesting than something the same shit from each faction. There are mods for that. True, 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 true. I should I should just download mods for that. Alright, let's just see if they attack us. Oh my god, it's been three hours. Almost four hours, fuck. Wood what Elves what always have strong armies. I, I think uh, it's because like even low tier Wood Elf units are good and they prioritize range units like they should. Ooh. Okay, Avalanche Mortars I might recruit. <laughs> what if we replace the Ogres with um, Avalanche Mortars? Deal? Deal or no deal? I'm replacing the Doom Wheel or the Ogres, so take your pick. Magical attacks. Ooh. Nah, nah. <coughs> I don't go. Unshackle AI recruitment, but after 20 battles, you will be insane because of power of enemy. Yeah, that's the thing. Like, if you tweaked it too much, then they'd be too strong at endgame. So, Doom Wheel replace the assassin. Doom Wheel is scuffed. Doom Wheel's. The Doom Wheel is more useful than the unit of ogres, though. It's way less squishy. I do love my ogres, but what if I transferred them? I can't really do that, but... <laughs> oh, I have to do it. Everyone's gonna scream and piss and cry, but... Oh, shit. Tower of the Bloody Tooth. Oh! Vampiric Corruption. This definitely seems to be a vampiric hotspot. I feel like Nagash is kind of like a foregone conclusion. You know, with this series, like, they gotta add him eventually, right? Like, they, they just gotta... I mean, I know he's, like, the super-powered guy that's not supposed to be in the game, kind of. Because he's too strong, technically, in the lore. Ugh. And I hate it when you get to this point, and it's like, I don't even know what to put points into anymore. Croak? Croak is stronger? Really? I mean, if Croak's in the game as a hero, maybe Nagash could be added as like a legendary hero for, for like maybe they could add it so that if you take Nagash's R and you do like a thing for like a couple of turns, you can then recruit him. Something like that, you know, like a goal. Because I would love zone goals, you know, like, like a uh, unique units you can equip for, you can get for certain factions by by like raiding a specific region. Because then your goal with um, fuck, what's his name? Manfred. You could be, you could play as Manfred, beeline through the mountains, take Nagash's arm, and then recruit Nagash. Like that'd be cool as fuck. Nagash could be weak at first, then once the campaign victory is done, he becomes swole. Yeah, well, or something like that. Like, he could get stronger and stronger, but get, like, XP 50% slower than most lords or something, just to keep him balanced. I don't know. I don't think you have to try that hard to make him balanced. Uh, we ambushes. Closing out the stream with an with an Imric ambush would be... would be peak. The vermin tide. Oh man, so many units. I'm not even gonna bother recruiting the fucking Eshin Triads. They were such a cool unit on paper too. As soon as I saw Eshin Triads, I was like, oh fucking ninja rats with with glaives? Dude, get in my ass. And then they just, they were super underwhelming. Not to say Clan Eshin still isn't fun, but fuck. Like, the units that I was most excited about for them, I think, were just kind of like mid. Oh! I want to close out the stream. 
Dude, like, of course that was gonna, gonna work. We had, like, overwhelming chance of victory. Multiplayer is cancer for this game and balance. Stop pandering to them. I mean... Nah, nah multiplayer is fine. I like multiplayer in this game. I think it's underrated for, for what... Like, obviously, there's so much that the campaign offers. Like, I just do that. I will always play the campaign over the multiplayer. But I like the multiplayer in this game still. Like, it's still fun. Especially on launch when everybody was kind of, like, new to Warhammer 3. And there was no metas and stuff. Uh, that's when I found it the most fun. It's kind of at the point now where everybody knows what's good. So every time I try and get into it, somebody just takes like all the meta shit and I go ogres as usual and then I get smoked. But uh, when ogres were buffed, man, and when nobody knew what was strong and what was weak and what was meta, it was so fun. I'm off to be real careful with these fucking... Doom wheel! Oh my god, dude, the amount of coverage you get, we're gonna get. I can cover an entire flank with just like two units. Alright. For cinematics alone, I have an idea for this. We're gonna hit some flanks no matter what here. This is gonna be cool as fuck. What are we missing? Alright, just, just charge. Charge and fuck up Imrik immediately. All right, hang on. I'm, gonna, I'm just gonna. I want this to look cinematic. I don't even give a fuck. I know that this is cheesy as fuck. I'm still doing it. I want to watch this. I want to watch the wall of rats close in around them. Hell yes. Water's hit in the middle. <laughs> 31 seconds, that's more than enough. Fuck it. Right. Get him! Get him, boys! They don't even know where to go! Yes! Yes! Fuck! Nobody saw that. Nobody saw that. Nobody saw that. Hell yeah, dude. Bruh. I thought it would fire quicker than that, man. Oh shit, the dragon. Forget about the dragon. Can I just... No, no, can't take it from melee mode, alright. Dude, Stormfirm and audio is so underrated. They do like those hisses and shit. That was a cool fucking fight though. Wait, can we watch Inmerg die? I wanna watch his little bug eyes get squished. Apparently not. Almost no casualties for my boy. Fight! Fight! Imrik, you ain't going anywhere! Alright, we gotta knock him over. Speed buffs. Alright, now get him. Get him. Get him. He's on a stupid fucking horse. Get him. No, get him! No! No, he can't get away! No! Get him! Yes! Body slam him! Body slam him! Interrupt him! Yeah, no, stop! He's fucking drifting! Get him! <laughs> yes! Fuck him up! Hit him! Bruh! Come on! Wait. Wait, wait, wait. I just- I can interrupt him. I can interrupt him. Here. New victim. <laughs> Why is it so slow? Come on! What? <laughs> Dick ass game. Okay. What's new about Tretch? Uh, 
46 speed storm vermin with devastating flanker shit tons of weapon strength uh his, some of his stuff got yes, reworked yes, yes. his um lucky skull helm arrow. gives some shit now which i just realized i'm trying to find it but i i can't it he basically just got a bunch of shit that worked there you go that as well treacherous raiders 35 meter effective range allies winning in the 35 meter uh, range get huge buffs just a lot of stuff man he's just better now Assassin. he's much better now I'd okay can somebody agree with me that there needs to be a little box right here at the bottom of your thing that tells you exactly how many team kills you did like if i hover over this it should tell me exactly how many of my own units died to this to this fucking mortar. I want to know. And also, I want a little box down here that tells me exactly how many kills I got with army abilities. Like, like, um, Ickit's Nuke. Tell me how many kills I managed to get with Ickit's Nuke at the end of the battle, please. Like, that should not be hard to calculate at all. Enslave them to Rictus. Agreed, agreed. Ugh, thank you. okay so we're gonna wrap it up for today today was fun as fuck dude this stream was awesome i had a lot of fun i hope you guys did uh tretch is fun now turns out no longer the butt of jokes we can't call him tretch craven fail anymore because he's actually pretty stacked we're gonna have to find a new punching bag, and I think that punching bag is the big fat meat-filled sack that is Greasus. I think he should become the butt of jokes for this game until CA decides that he, you know, is due a rebalance. Which he needs, God damn it! So maybe like... I don't know, there's so much you could do with him, but, but like I have a few suggestions. Unless you're Flying Taco. Dude, Flying Taco taking... Greasus in multiplayer tournaments and doing well is just he's such a chad uh, Yeah, I'm a big fan of flying taco. He always takes the most fun builds He's he like I, I've been watching that dude per participate in tournaments for years, man. He's a he's a solid solid participant But anyway, so next next stream I'm either gonna be doing uh, ogres and SFO or I'm gonna try and do uh, a multiplayer stream where we have Everybody that comes into the into the, the fight picks a doom stack and then the other person picks a doom stack and then whoever wins with that doom stack stays on and then the next person that comes in picks a new doom stack to try and kill that doom stack. So it's just doom stack versus doom stacks and we just see which one kind of stays on top for the longest, right? Until somebody finds like a one that kind of breaks the whole formula. So most but it has to be doom stacks. Like it has to be like a general and then an entire 19 of a specific unit. And also if the general so like if you're playing Ikit and you make a, a doom wheel doom stack, he has to be on a doom wheel mount. No exceptions. Like if they have that option. So that'll be it. It's kind of like top trumps, but for doom stacks, but in, in a multiplayer 1v1 uh, thing where I'm spectating. So that or uh, SFO ogres. I might put it up to a vote. Who knows? But yeah. Thanks for the donos. Thanks for watching. Hope you guys have fun. Try out Tretch. Give him a whirl. Fuck it. I mean, I think everybody has, but you know, if you haven't, Try him out. He's good now, kind of. Wouldn't Pompous Doomstacks just always win? No, it's in multiplayer, so Pompous isn't a thing. It's 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 in like custom battles. Anyway, anyway, so it's just down to down to the basic stats of the unit. All right, yeah. Thanks for watching, guys. I'll see you on the next one.